All right, we are live, my people. Welcome to the show. We are live. All right, my people, welcome to the show. Thank you so much, everybody, for being here. Your favorite host, Louise Wachu, outside us in the building. Today, it's going to be a great show. We have an author whose books I have right here, Reyes Neza Boneza. I can see you're connected in the studio, but uh, your mic and your camera are not connected. Please connect your camera and your mic so I can bring you into the show, but I can see that you're connected. Thank you so much for being here. My people, I have the books right here, and I have the book right here. These two books by the same author. We're going to talk to him. I love them so much. The first one is poetry, and then this one is a story. It's a story. It's a tragic story in Congo. But it's written in such a beautiful way. And it, it, the, the, the story itself is poetic, uh, even though it's not necessarily a, a po another poetry book. But the story itself is so poetic. I love it so much. And it's, uh, it has succeeded in capturing, like telling such a tragic story, but in a very beautiful, very poetic way, even though it's, you know, it's so tragic. So I can't wait to have the author into the show so we can talk about it. Let's begin the show. Everybody who's following uh, YouTube, Facebook, please tell me that you can uh, see me. Please tell me that everything is fine. And then we're here for you and now, my people. <laughs> All right, my people. So um, the author is having uh, difficulties um, connecting, but, um, you know, uh, hopefully he's going to be able to connect. So the author that we're speaking to who wrote these two books is Mr. Reis Neza Boneza. And uh, Mr. Reis Neza Boneza is a peace activist. Uh, and practitioner, and he uses his work to promote artistic expression as a means of conflict transformation and maintain well-being, spiritual growth, and healing, my people. We're looking for healing because, as you know, many of us have survived great tragedies, and uh, it's not just about surviving uh, whatever tragedy or history that you have been through, it's also about healing afterwards. You know, we seek healing for the victims and redemption for the um, for the perpetrators, for the oppressors, and, and stuff like that. So hopefully, the author is going to be able um, to connect. Uh, let me show you in the meantime. Uh, his uh, picture and uh, talk a little bit about uh, his books. Um, after the part in English, uh, we'll also have a Rwandan artist, a Rwandan musician who's going to come into the show and we're going to talk about uh, what's the best way to commemorate what happened uh, in Rwanda. That will be the section that we talk about it. Uh, and then we'll also have a Kenya Rwanda part uh, at the end of the show uh, and, and speak to uh, some Rwandan uh, international activists. And uh, the show is also open to uh, everyone. It's open mic. Uh, if anyone wants to come into the show and uh, say something, I would, uh, you know, I would love that. So uh, let me uh, show you... Um, the, let me, I'm putting in a link where everybody can uh, uh, 
come to that link and um, you know comment if they if you want to comment or if you have something to say uh, that's the link I just posted it it's available on the uh, YouTube uh, comment section um, so it's telling me right now that I'm not seeing the uh, comments um, that are coming from Facebook um, I'm only seeing um, comments that are coming from uh, YouTube. I am not seeing comments that are coming from Facebook and Twitter. So people who are watching uh, on Facebook and commenting, I appreciate it, but I'm not seeing your comments. So please comment on uh, YouTube so that I can see your comments. And then I just put in the link also on YouTube where if you want to come in the studio and say something, express yourself, I'm listening to you. So the author uh, that we are trying to speak to who is trying to connect, uh, who's having difficulties connecting, is uh, Raiz Boneza, who has written uh, this, this book. First of all, this book is so beautiful. It's beautiful poetry. Uh, it's poetic. It's poetry. I can read you like <laughs> one, you know, one poem you know uh let me read uh, one poem here on page 15 uh which says uh, the poem is titled april april so i i chose it randomly and i think it's appropriate because we are in april so you know why not read one of his poems which uh, which is titled uh, april the winter snow and frost have finally gone the sun has chased them away, far away, and won. The crocus raises their gentle heads so neat. The hair scent's rich scent is strong and sweet. The trees are blooming, standing tall and slender. For Cynthia bushes shine in golden splendor. My heart is like the moistened ground, so tender. Now I am ready to surrender. <laughs> so anyways, um, Raiz Neza Boneza was born in uh, former Zaire, which is now called the, the uh, Democratic Republic of Congo. He's a writer, he's a poet with poetry collections and fiction uh, as well. And he has written several articles and essays on transformative justice. And uh, as a scholar, he's been traveling in Africa, around the world as a lecturer, educator, consultant for NGOs and other institutions. And uh, his work is premised on peace and conflict transformation and human rights issues coming out of Africa and the diaspora. And uh, Amani, Amani, which is the uh, title of this book means peace in Kiswahili and is a blend of both profound, beautiful, dark poetry, but always appealing to peace, love, and hope of this world and ours. Amani means peace, my people. And as you can see, um, on top of meaning peace, Amani means peace. On top of that, Amani is the same exact words that you use for Amani, which means peace in Swahili, is the same exact words that we use for Imana, which means the supreme being in Kinyarwanda. And as you know, the supreme being is indeed Amani. And Amani is our foundation because the Supreme Being is Amani. Oh, Raiz is here! Oh my goodness, this is so beautiful. Oh. Yes. Raiz, thank you so much for being here. Yeah, thank you for inviting me. <laughs> this is such perfect timing because uh, as I am speaking about Amani, and then finally it works, right? <laughs> yeah. Ah, this is so beautiful. So, uh, first of all, you know, thank you so much for being here. And uh, I loved, I loved, loved your books. You know, like, 
you know, like I was so surprised, you know, I'm starting with this because this is the one that I have in my hands right now. Uh, and yeah. I was so pleasantly surprised by uh, this one. You know, people, you can get it on uh, Amazon. Uh, please, Amani, Rais, Neza, Boneza. And I was so pleasantly surprised because it's like, I was not expecting it. I didn't know what to expect, you know what I mean? So I'm just so pleasantly surprised. And I'm like, wow, like, can we start by the uh, poetry book so that you can explain to us how you even come up with this poetry? So do you like think in Swahili and then you bring it into English? And then um, maybe we could even start from your journey. So I was just telling people that you were born in uh, Zaire, which is now called the Democratic Republic of Congo. And yeah. everything you write, you have been, um, have you been through conflict? And this is why it has touched you so much and you feel the need to bring healing and peace. And so you write about peace and healing and poetry. I'm listening. Thank you so much. Yeah, thank you for inviting me. And then also thank you for everyone that is following us now. And I'm happy to be with you. Um, when it's come to my writing in general, so I can give you a um, short story. I started writing actually when I'm still a little bit younger. Uh, yeah, quite young. And uh, I was quite very interesting, uh, interested of uh, writing uh, uh, love letters. So I've been used by adults to write lo love letters to, yeah, they will just give me the description of the person or show me the, pers the person from far so I can write something for them and then uh, back I will be paid by uh, uh, having a ticket for the cinema and things like that when I'm, uh, I was young. So. And uh, later, so I take it seriously. So I didn't stop writing love letters, but uh, now I wanted to explore different things. And then that was uh, much, uh, too much about poetry. And um, by at some point, I wanted to give a sense to my poems and the society and all the change and happening in the Congo, in not only in the Congo, but in the region, the whole region um started affecting me uh, affecting me in my, my very being so i wanted to to uh to chant the beauty that is around but also to to talk nicely uh not ni not necessarily nicely uh, but uh, put a little bit of uh, uh humanity or um uh into the writing yeah and sometimes without necessarily accusing uh, any parties, but trying to include everyone as part of actually the the problem, but part also the solution that we can uh, find. This is what I, I I can say for now. But uh, um, also on beside that, so, um, my uh, my um, my career also is around peace and conflict transformation, but not resolution, but transformation which is quite a little bit different than what we can call a resolution because I believe that um, uh, you cannot just resolve a conflict as long as there is a, um, a community or we are two, or even with yourself, there is uh, all the time uh, the conflict er erased, uh, arise inside or outside. So the only things we need to transform the conflict so that it doesn't bring up what the real diseases, which is uh, the killings and the violence. Yeah. So there is a difference between conflict and violence. So uh, I'm not um, a pacifist as uh, per se. I'm a, a non-violent person. I can say. Mm -hmm. I completely hear you. So a lot of times, uh, you know. Congo is sort of ignored and uh, neglected, you know. Is, is this something that you feel when you come on the scene and you're from Congo, but your conflict is ignored and uh, neglected and not a lot of people are talking about it? And, and how, like, how do you feel about it? And then, uh, you know, right, is this one of the things that pushed you into uh, writing and wanting to expose the conflict a bit more. 
Yes, of course, it's not uh, that is ignored. It's just neglected because uh, the conflict uh, is there and everyone almost but for the usual person in the West, sometimes it's not, they don't know what is going on, even though uh, their own government is part of the, the, the problem. So it's just neglected. And uh, that is quite very um, painful inside, uh, especially when it comes to people that seem and think uh, that uh, they, will, they will want to help, but they end up um, uh, they end up trying to continue the same cycle of uh, ignorance and uh, um, ignorance and neglection of the, the, the problematic around. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And um, so how is your how are your books received? You know, like, for example, when you go somewhere to speak and to present your book, how is the book received? Uh, like, what is the audience saying? Are they shocked? Or is it, do you somehow humanize a story that was vague from the beginning, but then when they see you as someone who is from there, speaking to them about it, and that, does it change something uh, when you go somewhere and you speak? It, it does change a lot because, uh, firstly, when um, I approach them, and I approach them uh, in a way that the, the uh, sometimes they think that I will come and say again things that are quite uh, complicated. But the thing is that I want to uh, to to show the problematic with a uh, with a human face, you know. Most of the time, you know, we talk about conflict, the war, and then things are very too much uh, complex for uh, people to understand, especially when it comes to the Great Lakes and the, and the Congo. So uh, sometimes uh, what uh, we need is to put the imagery and bring up uh, the uh, a face a face to the conflict. So uh, um, that part, uh, personally, I, I'm also the face of that that conflict there but also the story that I bring in. So it's not that vague. So it's not that easy for everyone to access uh, from the youth to the, the adult. So most of the time uh, it's well um, uh, received, um, but there is a lot to, uh, all the time, a lot of questions because the question go beyond even the, the, the border of the Great Lakes, the borders of the Congo, the border, uh, beyond Africa, because you have to connect the dots. Uh, with whatever happening the, in the world, all the conflict happening in the world, we have to connect the dot, the dot, but because uh, we are at some point interconnected, um, if not globally, economically, but also all this conflict um, as a reason, because a, uh, the, there is conflict because it's something that we, uh, as human, we create. It's not the um, uh, the, the violence is not is not natural, you know. Absolutely. And um, so this is something, this is, this, this, I really loved this book. And I was like, I couldn't just wait to get to the end of it to know how it turns out. And I, I think this book has accomplished, you know, accomplished so much of uh, what you, you were saying, because at the same time, it's like putting humans in a situation talking about a huge conflict, but it brings it down to these, these humans, a human situation. And then at the same time, it's packed with regular issues that every human faces, no matter where they are in the world, such as friendship, you know, the friend that you start a journey with. Is it the same friend that you're going to end uh, this journey with? And then when you go on the journey, uh, the way that you discover yourself and then the way that you discover your friend. And then I also love how uh, you, you speak about um, the minerals in Congo that the people, everyone is trying to get. And I love how in the end you explain what these minerals are and how important they are and what they actually do uh, in the world so that someone can understand the conflict so really congratulations on this book it's so beautiful and it, it feels like a painting you know like 
it feels like a painting and you describe it so well and and it's poetic at the same time even though it's not really poetry but it's it's also poetic you know um so i was wondering is it based on your story or someone that you know <laughs> you know like because it's at the same time it's also tragic you know what i mean you know so i'm wondering and the people you can see the image uh, it's called white el dorado black fever i'm gonna leave it there for a minute uh please go on amazon and buy it support 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 our fellow africans authors poets writers uh go ahead and get it my people so Tell us, is it based on your own personal story or someone that you know? I'm kind of, you know, like, I'm hoping not, but at the same time, I'm like, oh, my God, if it's you, what, what am I going to do? You know what I mean? <laughs> let's, say, let's say the poetry is, around, is about me, but uh, also the people that actually you find in a book, the, the real people that have uh, exist or the, existed. Because what I did, I had a um, mission and... Uh, um, uh, so some some five years uh, five years ago, uh, in Goma, uh, I had to go and visit um, um, uh, displaced uh, people camp, and then where I, while visiting the camp, so I, I got stories, different stories, uh, from people uh, coming from different areas, uh, you know, the conflict zone around uh, the, the, the the Kivus, and uh, there were. Quite very different and very um, uh, so, sometimes, uh, as I said, complex and complicated to just uh, uh, explain this to uh, to uh, others. So I decided that no, uh, what I will do, I will put a little, a, a little bit of mine uh, because I'm at some point in my life too. I've, I've been actually affected by the conflict. Uh, at some point in my life, has been I've been a refugee. I, during during the the war for so called liberation so we have i've worked long you know uh, more than 2000 kilometers by by foot i've done it too so that, uh, even though i was not supposed to do that but uh, that i've opened also a little bit my eyes uh, to the kind of society we live in um, that promotes more um, the love of uh, death and uh, um, desperation that the love of life and togetherness so yeah so i've decided to write that and, and put it in a way that actually uh, what that will be reflected is also a, an experience of really people that have have been there and they exist so to put that human face to the huge the global conflict that is there even though we don't, uh, some other people will not uh, call it uh, globally because, you know, everything that is happening in Africa, it's uh, Africans, but uh, without uh, uh, trying to, um, uh, without us. So so the thing that, and then later you, you can explain a little bit because everyone has written on the coltan, for example, there is not only the coltan, but there is uh, more than that. So. Uh, it's complicated when you start explaining to someone, um, just a usual person, a usual worker, uh, around about it. So sometimes he will even ask you, so I should not use any more the computer, I should not use any more the mobile phone or whatever. For me, my response should be only that we need to use the technology that we have, uh, we need to use it friendly. So uh, because of the conflict and the, the people that it affects um, and sometimes we end up uh, uh, actually financing and supporting uh, the the problematic, even though we we are very far from it. Yeah, yeah. And another thing that I really loved um, in this book is how you care about what's happening to women. You know, like even though it's written from a male perspective, even though it's uh, uh, men going through the story, but you do not ignore what's happening around you. And one of the things that is uh, heartbreaking to the main character is the plight of women, uh, you know, wherever he goes, uh, how women, how the conflict in Congo has transformed uh, men 
and how the transformation that men have suffered causes them to mistreat uh, women. What is like a, a healing a solution to that? You know, like how are people supposed to survive uh, such a thing? And uh, like, wh what do you think is going to be um, the, the solution? And how are people going to heal from such grave violations of, you know, of, of everybody's rights, you know, but yeah. I really like how you care about women and how you do not, you, 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 you show the audience, you tell the audience what's happening on the men's side, but also on the women's side. So what do you think is going to serve as healing, you know, in your work? So, yeah, the, we cannot, we cannot, um, uh, talk about a solution when uh, there is no solution for the condition of women. So the liberation of the women in the region is quite important. Uh, not only in Congo, but in Africa in general, the, the real liberation of women. Uh, and uh, we, we cannot resolve any conflict or any political uh, problematic when actually uh, we're still uh, uh, having the women on the uh, uh, down there, uh, and uh, um, and uh, to let them being even uh, more victimized by the conflict uh, uh, or the the violence that we do because they are more uh, uh, they are two times more affected by us than uh, we are. and uh, in a society as I said in general I say in general in the society we cannot as long as women are not liberated so we are not going to be liberated. Uh, at some at some point, so that's why we need to recognize this. And the real liberation is not about just uh, or trying to give some post around political post, because still, even though we, there is uh, some pres uh, uh, the presence of women in uh, in politics, but still uh, they, they they work for the same uh, oppressive uh, system, which is patriarchal and uh, yeah, uh, men dominated actually. So you can find that some women too, they get also victim, they got to victimize also their, uh, their, their own kind at some point because actually they are working for um, already a, co a corrupt structure. So is um, the solution will come through structures that we need to, we need to restructure actually um, our, our systems there. And to restructure our, our system, we need to go back and learn about the story and then actually to try to emulate the story of uh, um, of dignity and uh, uh, sovereignty and uh, uh, and freedom. That uh, that's what is needed. Mm -hmm. So, do you think like what would be the best path, the solution to finding peace in Congo? Because it seems as if, um, well, to me it seems like. Um, you have such a, a great nation, a very rich nation, and there are predators, international predators for many generations. Uh, the only reason why they come to Africa is because Africa is so rich. Today they turn around and call Africa poor, but if Africa was poor, nobody would come to Africa. The whole reason why they ever came to Africa was because Africa was so rich and they come there to get the, that wealth. Uh, and in the process of getting that wealth, they are willing to destroy everything and everyone. And then the Congo also has these neighbors like uh, uh, Rwanda and Uganda who are being used to uh, sabotage Congo or to help the predators uh, sabotage Congo and uh, pillage uh, in Congo. So mm -hmm. what is the solution? You know, because recently we saw that uh, Congo has now joined the East African community, you know, and I was like, well, the East African community, they're talking about it's a trade, free trade area, but can we mm -hmm. really have a union uh, when you have countries in the East African community who have participated in the invasion and the destruction of Congo. And now all of a sudden Congo becomes in the same region as, as these countries, but we have had no justice. 
uh, and yet we're supposed to have this uh, union, this community. Is this community going to disregard all these issues that some countries may have between each other, mainly between Rwanda uh, and Uganda, because Rwanda and Uganda are the ones who brought trouble to Congo. So like, what do you see as a solution when you have international predators coming for Congo, but then they are also using uh, Africans, uh, neighbors of Congo, Rwanda and Uganda in order to use them uh, to destroy Congo as well. What do you think is the best solution out of this? You know, <clears throat> when you are in a community or in a, in a house, uh, if the uh, people are united in one house, uh, the enemy outside will not really uh, do uh, too much. Even though they do, there will be some kind of, um, of force, a force to, uh, to stand up. And the problematic of the Congo is the, not only because of the neighbors uh, around uh, doing it, but also it's because also the people in the Congo themselves, uh, they never really um, internalized uh, their, uh, their, uh, their independence, yeah? uh, what they want from the independences. So many in the Congo, they don't even know what it's all about, why, uh, in which, can we call it a nation? We don't have that sense of nation in Congo. And that is very difficult because we don't know how to um, uh, define the Congo, what the Congo want to be, want to be, uh, we, we are resisting. Of course, they said, oh yeah, we are resisting. We want to be one. Uh, but Congo is um, very, um, uh, it's composed of very uh, many nations. Uh, so we need first to have this uh, talk inside and trying to unite all the very nations that is found in the Congo. And beside that, we have neighbors. And sometimes neighbors, they share the same, um, uh, the, 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 uh, let's say, the, uh, the same cultural background, uh, the deep, culture, uh, deep culture, you know. Um, from there, uh, from Rwanda to Congo, you you you, you can enter. Sometimes you don't find actually uh, the differences, and uh, from Uganda at the same time, all with our neighbors. Um, that is the the, the, the uh, first things we have to do to work hard with the population. So it's a good thing with the cooperation, you know. Um, Congo to be part of the East African Union, yes. But you know, in the African Union, uh, East African Union itself, there have been a lot of problematic. You know, Rwanda and uh, Burundi, they are not that good friend uh, with Tanzania, less. So you see, uh, all this, um, we need to work on that too. So th th those are political, but uh, the solution can, the political uh, solution can come when we actually also emulate a good. Um, uh, system, uh, democratic system actually that understand that there is right justice that must be done for everyone, not for a specific uh, group or something for everyone, so that we can bring that uh, about peace. Because now we are talking about the, uh, we are living in a system where we have uh, the bad guy and the good guy. So you go in Congo, people are like uh, swearing on Rwanda. Uh, you go to run, uh, people are swearing on each other, and no one can even talk anymore uh, to the truth. Uh, uh, to, de to even to, uh, to to say the truth to the the power, yeah, you are already afraid to say that because the power in place doesn't allow this this emancipation um, uh, of freedom. So the things that if this happen, uh, still happening like that, that's why all these leaders will still be uh, using us um, and using the military and uh, um, the, the, the resources that are available actually to make about peace and cooper cooperation and solidarity. That is more important than cooperation and solidarity to use those resources actually to, um, uh, to influence uh, uh, violence and wars. So, yeah, actually the change must be, yeah, in the, how to, we educate the people down, but we have to have a radical change also on the, on, on the leadership. Because the leadership, let us say in the region, the leadership is terrible. We have a bad government in Congo, does nothing to, for his uh, 
uh, the, the population in Congo, but uh, just uh, uh, a lot of corruption, even though uh, um, about corruption uh, we can discuss long live. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you, the same thing in Rwanda, where there is no uh, that uh, uh, good space for freedom, and then of course there is a lot of issues uh, about uh, or we can reconcile uh, reconcile each other because we cannot just bring reconciliation um, uh, um, in, uh, uh, inside, and then the, that reconciliation that you have to bring inside that must be a true reconciliation for it for you to actually. Um, uh, bring about peace, not only inside, but also outside. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, so do you think uh, the democratic way of uh, changing leaders is going to work for us? You know, because we have bad leaders, but it's like these leaders have also been manipulated and imposed upon our countries by some foreign powers, you know, like in Rwanda, for example, the dictatorship that we have right now was supported by uh, the Americans and the British uh, to come to power and they were armed uh, and they came to power by the power of the guns, you know, and uh, they stay in power uh, through the gun and they kill uh, the opposition and they they make people go into e exile uh, because they offer no freedom of speech whatsoever and they control everything. Um, so how are we going to get that uh, leadership that would allow for the population to heal? Because the population is not healing even though they have suffered so much. Like There's so much suffering, uh, for example, in this book. But how are all these people going to heal from their suffering if from the top, uh, you know, we don't have this leader and how are we going to get this leadership? Uh, you know, what do you think are, are, are our options? The options, are, the options are there, but you know, the thing is that, uh, you know, we live in a, so our societies around the, 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 the uh, around the region, uh, we are totally traumatized, I can tell you. Uh, people are to traumatized so, totally so that uh, sometimes even death is like something very normal. So we have normalized death, uh, uh, normal, uh, because of course of this um, leadership that is actually, that we need to get rid of. And this, the way to get it rid of, so then can be discussed in many manner. Uh, but now it's like that we don't even, uh, we are not, we are even afraid about, uh, when we have to talk about changes, because no one wanna <laughs> leave power uh, around. So, but we have to on the, our side, on my side, what I will talk, uh, I will say more. We have to work on more on trying to demilitarize first the mind of the population, because we have been too much militarized, and that is happening also, of course, also today uh, in 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 the world with the Ukrainian war, imperialistic war that is happening in Ukraine. So the thing is that we are totally. Uh, militarizing in our heads that we need actually to find a way to demilitarize our uh, our mind. And um, in Congo, it's uh, still there. There, there, are, there are many several groups and uh, several uh, several leaders, not only in Congo, even in, in Rwanda, that are for change. They are still uh, fighting the oppressive regimes that are there. And this, of course, is difficult. But we cannot just sit there and say. No, but how can we find the solution? The, the, the struggle has to continue by uh, whatever means we got uh, to change the, the, to change the, the regimes or to change the structures that are in place that are actually uh, promo uh, promoting only death and, uh, and no life because there's no life there. It's just death now. Mm. So yeah, it's some it's a work that is in progress, and I I think is in progress everywhere. Everywhere, every groups are working on their ways, the way they can uh, uh, bring a change about it. So yeah, I cannot talk for everyone, but for me, it's firstly trying to uh, demilitarize the mind of the population. We and try to to bring back the humanity that have been removed uh, forcibly, uh, forcibly uh, into the the, the, the region. Hi. 
Absolutely. And I think your books are doing exactly that, you know, to demilitarize the mind because uh, you are making people think. You are making people think and then you are, you are humanizing, uh, you know, you are humanizing, you're putting humans uh, stories to a conflict that is so huge. And by telling a story and focusing on some characters, then people can really understand through uh, such a story. And it's so powerful because um, since ancient times, the way that Africans uh, communicate uh, education and healing is through telling stories, you know, and even the way that the human being is constructed, um, it's better to tell them a story uh, than to even uh, explain some political concepts uh, because the story will be remembered and then the lesson that is contained within the story, you know, they will get the lesson. So I really love what you have succeeded in accomplishing uh, in writing your books because you're doing exactly that, that you're saying that the minds need to be demilitarized uh, and so that people can see themselves beyond, you know, beyond the conflict, right? So it's really beautiful. And then another thing that I loved in, uh, in this book is um, how... I don't know if I'm sort of spoiling it for others who will read it, but you have a, a doctor, you know, you have a doctor, yes. a, a traditional healer, a Muganga, as we yes. call him. And uh, this doctor is, is, is such a great man. And it's just such a beautiful thing to see such a great man in the midst of all this madness. You see a man who is still living in dignity and who is still an honorable man, you know, among all this corruption. And it shows you that it is possible and that it can be done. And this man is, um, is based on, um, on his culture, on his uh, history. You, you can see that what makes this man so powerful is that he knows his culture. He knows uh, his history. So, how did you think about this character? And then it makes me think about uh, Dr. Mukwege, who is yeah. a very well-known honorable in like. Congo, yeah. Nobel Peace Prize winner, right? You know, so yes. I don't know. Tell me more about this character. Yeah, this character came about, you know, I, I've been thinking about, you know, uh, what do you think about this problematic of peace? And then you have... Uh, 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 in, imagine in Congo, we have uh, 90 million of uh, of people. That means 19 million of uh, um, of brains there. And then you go to Rwanda, probably 20 million. I don't know. I'm not sure. But that means 20 million of brains. You know, go to Uganda, go to Tanzania. All these brains. So imagine with all these brains. That means that there is no one who wants really peace. There is no one who, who is a heel around. So. I've been traveling and around the region, so I've met the such such of people with that still stand with their dignity in the, all this mess, yeah. And then we don't talk too much about that, yeah. And what the story that come out uh, about is uh, all the story of all the mess that is around, and that, until that uh, it become only numbers, death numbers, whatever numbers, statistical about the statistic, uh, statistic about poverty, statistic. That, so all is totally negative and a mess. But there is this beauty in this region, and about there is this uh, humanity you still find. Uh, this Ubuntu uh, spirit that is around, still around, and uh, that is manifesting in uh, different people and that are still actually standing up in all uh, this mess. So, yeah, you, you can see uh, there is many. We can uh, not only sit the example of Dr. Mukwege. That, that is something uh, that actually uh, we can say, you know, uh, you have this uh, Nobel Peace Prize and, and this uh, this doctor that I said, and that those are kind of the healers that we need. But you know, in their, our own region, no, 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 we don't like to talk about them, yeah, because of what? No, the government doesn't, uh, yeah, really like them actually. Uh, the government, the system doesn't like those healers because the things that we, we talk about is leadership all the time. But we, what we need more is healers. 
because leadership is about control you know you have the power you control yeah so and then we end up um, perpetuating the this horizontal kind of uh, 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 vertical kind of power structure where there is a leader there it may be strong or weak but uh, you know and then we are just down there um, miserably in our bad situation but what you need is uh, those healers that can bring this society on an horizontal uh, way of thinking where we are you and me we are together uh, we go together and we fail together so that's uh, that, that's the the the, the, the real uh, role of the uh, healer in our society and that we need actually to promote those people those voice that uh, uh are there actually and standing up even when sometimes they don't even talk but their work the small things they do trying to just meet people bringing people together very important absolutely absolutely it's like tell the uh the good story you know the the, the good stories that are inspiring uh so that even the next generation can see those examples of the good people and the good story so that they know that there is way more than you know like the bad story are more way more broadcast than the good story yeah. but it, people need the good story even for healing you know yeah we need to yeah we need to to inspire uh, people to the good stories and and that's help actually to the healing and it's help also to changing the structures of power because that uh, is true healing that we can change also the structures of power because we are totally traumatized not only uh, by colonization but already already back you know with by whatever they've done against us uh, slavery and today by by globalization so when they start their wars their wars become global wars and then even though we are, have nothing to do with that. So, and then when it, it comes down, uh, of course, they are them, still them trying to feel, to uh, give us weapons, even though we don't produce those weapons. But we are talk, talking about all the time having a strong military uh, to, but the strong military to do what? To to fight against each other? There are, there are some some countries, who, some uh, nation around the world who ha don't have those strong militaries, but they're living in peace. So, so why why is it only us? Yeah. A question. Absolutely. If you're going to have a strong military, you should at least be uh, to defend to defend yeah. the country, not to attack your own population. You know. No. And if uh, if Rwanda neighbors or Uganda they have a strong military, it shouldn't be used to go and attack our brothers in Congo. It should be to protect uh, to protect if Congo is attacked or another country is attacked. But it's really yeah. shameful to see African countries and even when they have strong militaries, like it's in the case of Rwanda, then that military is used to destroy our fellow Africans, you know? And then the military is also used to like defend the French interest in Mozambique, uh, yeah. fr defend the French interest in another African country, defend the British interest in some other yeah. far land. You know, so even this strong military is not serving African interests. So what's but we talk, we, we call them we, we we call them strong because they are they are oppressing us. They are just uh, oppressive military, oppressive groups. I, I cannot say that in Africa we have this uh, strong military because we if we had this strong military, we couldn't be fighting each other. We will be actually protecting the interests of the African people, the continent. We will be standing up against all the dictates that come from France from. Uh, the U.S. from the, the, the Europeans, as uh, per se, if we say we say that, that will what we will be using on the, our defenses. But no, the, the, our defenses we use it to oppress ourselves and uh, to to perpetuate the, the cycle, the cycle of all the misery that is found there. And then we sometimes we talk about ah, oh, there is we have some some. Uh, good uh, example of a uh, good economy, good uh, uh, peace. But the only things we have in the region is negative peace. Yeah, It's not a peace that is sustainable for long term. As long as there is no trouble around there, so you will be not, uh, they will not, you will never be in, tr uh, in peace at all. So uh, it's just uh, oppressive uh, groups uh, controlled by one person mostly, uh, one person or one family or one group. 
and for the interest not of the uh, our population, uh, but the interest of themselves and uh, the, the 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 power uh, outside. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Wow, Raiz, thank you so, 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 so much. This is so inspiring. I love what you're doing. And um, uh, just to uh, end, um, uh, you know, as we end this show, there's uh, something that, that also touched me with, was, uh, you know, when, uh, when you see that um, uh, the population um, of Congo uh, in the culture of Congo, which is usually a very, like, uh, the hospitality, you know, and they're so generous and they have great sense of hospitality and they have this want to uh, generosity, humanity. And then um, this sense of hospitality is getting destroyed um, because these populations have been attacked and they have been abused. You know, they have only received predators uh, who have abused their hospitality and their generosity, you know. And this is, you know, it's so touching. It's tragic because it's like you see a nation which is so welcoming, which has welcomed so many people. Like a lot of Rwandans have lived in, in Congo for generations and they never had any issues uh, in Congo for generations, and it's only when they betray the uh, the the trust and uh, they 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 work, they collaborate with the invaders or the predators, that then the population retrieves and is now you know suspicious, you know suspicious to the point where they now suspect even their own you know their own people to the point where you know one of the main characters in the book has, you know, problems with the population, even though he's completely innocent, but because the population has been so abused, then the population is kind of reluctant to practice that Ubuntu anymore. You know, like, what do you think about that? And how are we going to get out of this? Because this is something that we have to preserve, you know, the Ubuntu, the sense of hospitality, the community, this is something that we have to preserve, but they've been so abused. So it's natural and normal that they are now less trusting, but how are we going to heal this? Because it's still so needed and we can't lose that because this is like the essence of who we are, you know? Yeah. Uh, the, 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 uh, the way to do that, uh, actually it's... Um, not uh, it's you and me what the work we are doing yeah is only uh, is already uh, on that way so we are many uh, even though yeah uh, we are doing differently the the, the work uh, to bring about this uh, the, the knowledge also to bring about actually the sense of dignity uh, back to these uh, places uh, to our people because there is the sense of dignity that is lost when you don't feel anymore as a human being, so you will just behave as a totally animal. Uh, the, today they are teaching us about um, survival, but the things we need to teach more about about living, and, and the living is the living together, not surviving. Uh, uh, surviving is for animals in the jungle. Um, so it's the work that we do uh, wherever we are, uh, different activists, political activists, um, healers, um, poets, writers, journalists. So to try to bring in um, uh, not only uh, the uh, the only, um, I can say, as I said, try to demilitarize the mind <laughs> around, but also uh, to, to bring out new ideas uh, because also we need to uh, evolve. We have seen different way, different system around. We know what doesn't work there what can work, but we don't need to just copy everything. So we need to create something that can, uh, that resemble us. And that resemble us is about uh, the, all this Ubuntu um, philosophy and uh, other philosophy that we got in, uh, in Africa. So, but system that actually reflects 
on our society and now uh, and on our need, yeah, not the, what other people define us. That is is about teaching education, still doing the some the work, even though you feel alone. I know I've been uh, sometimes depressed about all the, this. Uh, but uh, I said, so when you look at um, at night, uh, you see the stars, you know, in the darkness, in the firmament. So you can say that that is the stars that are there. There can be only one, but uh, still in the darkness, it will be just shining. Uh, yeah. So this this is the way we have to see things. Absolutely. I thank you so much for being a star in uh, in in the sky and the shining light, even though there is uh, so much darkness uh, surrounding um, the issue. This is exactly what is needed. People need to see these stars shining. And I thank you so much for being one of them. Um, I, see, I have here a picture of you uh, on tour speaking. You have more books. So where can people find you and uh, how can people support your work? And are you having any events coming um, so that people can come in and support you? Uh, what are your future plans so that people can be part of it? You know, like tell us uh, before we let you go, you know, how people can find you and support you. Yeah, there, there is events coming. Uh, that's uh, actually because now, you know, uh, we need to, uh, actually to give a, uh, um, uh, uh, to give a, a word, um, a more word, more um, power to the word peace, because now we are talking about war uh, all over the world, and then we are talking about only about war. So people are not talking anymore about peace. So you don't have to understand if we, what will be the the solution with whatever is happening uh, uh, in uh, in Ukraine there, and then we forgot uh, about how the other countries in the world suffering. Uh, like in Yemen, in Congo, uh, of course, in uh, Syria. We have forgot about the Palestinian. We have forgot about all the wars. So they, now there is only one war that is, yeah, that is they're trying to make it our wars. Yeah. So, and then, yeah, so, so there is event on the, that sense. I'm trying to, to invite some other uh, poets from different na uh, uh, countries, nations like Pakistan, Yemen and and, and do uh, some um, and do something together uh, that will be in the coming six months. That uh, so it's still in preparation. Uh, but to get in touch with me, so I have my website raisnezaboneza.no. Uh, then you can just uh, send an email. Uh, if if you want to have my books, if you have to want to sign books, you can send to me an email or you can order it, it through the website. That will be easy. You can then you support me directly instead of, uh, you know, all the publication things and uh, the percentage. That <laughs> yeah, that's yeah, totally. What's the email <laughs> that they can send you uh, to? Yeah. So Which yeah, that's uh, yeah. Also, other things is inv about inviting me to any um, yeah any venue that you want. Um, I don't need necessarily to talk, but I I would love to be part of whatever. Is happening if you are organizing something peaceful in uh, something that goes on the way on what we are talking about about healing, demilitarizing the mind, uh, about peace uh, in the world, but not uh, a peace about pacifying our mind. No, 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 because we can still stand and fight I, anyway. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, I would love to be part of it. Uh, yes, otherwise I'm uh, very happy to be to have been with you today. <laughs> Thank you so much. Is that right? Reis Neza Boneza that no, right? Yes. For Norway, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. Okay, perfect. This is where um, everybody can find you. Wow, Raiz, thank you so much. I appreciate your time. I appreciate everything that you're doing. And this is like what you're doing is exactly what we need. And, you know, I always want to people to have in mind to be conscious that, you know, conflicts uh, started uh, in other places and then they landed uh, in yeah. Congo, you know, like the whole point of uh, Rwandan conflict, you know, because people talk about Rwanda, but what was the purpose of the Rwandan conflict? It's to have access uh, to Congo, you know, so yeah. people die in Rwanda, but it's not even about Rwanda. 
that the war is happening in Rwanda, the whole purpose of the war and the conflict in Rwanda is that so they can bring conflict to Congo. Yeah. So it's important and it's imperative that as Africans, we connect those dots, you know, yeah. instead of uh, one uh, group being here, one group being here, and then we never know how our conflicts are connected. So it's yeah. very important that Rwandans realize that their problems, you know, if they don't deal with their problems and fix them, then they have consequences in Congo and they cause so much more devastation. So we should deal with our problems and make sure that we don't export our problems um, to the neighbors, you know? Yeah, and then that is for, the, yeah. That is the danger of one narrative. Because now we, when when there is a conflict, there's only one narrative, the narrative of the the, the more powerful ones. We don't listen uh, to the weakened one, even though we got uh, all these NGOs. Because NGOs, they are some kind uh, some kind of organization that bring actually back to uh, colonization and other ways. You know, they discuss about the problematic of people down there without talking about what the the people really need. To to uh, to advance uh, um, development or uh, any other issues, so they will all the time uh, stay in big hotels, but discussing about the problematic. But they will never see them about going and talk directly to the people that are in need. So yeah, so the only the one narrative of the strong ones versus the weak one that cannot talk anymore, and that's why we are here, uh, all of us. The one who are listening and you and all the network of uh, uh, yeah is you know is powerful and um, thank you also for your your work that I admire a lot <laughs> yes and many blessings. I agree. Thank you so much. So before we let you go, is there anything that you want to tell the audience that we haven't touched? Uh, or a call to action, you know, something that you feel like, you know, uh, if you go out of the show without saying it, you'll be like, ah, oh, why didn't I say that? <laughs> <laughs> Probably there is a lot of things we didn't to talk about, but uh, yeah, the only yeah. thing, yeah, yeah. So that's we will sure. definitely have more conversations. We will definitely yeah. have more conversations. It's the first time that uh, you, you're on the show, but it's not the last time. We will definitely continue the conversation. And I'm Thank listening, you. you know, and then every time you have new books, I'm going to buy all your books and I'm going to keep promoting them because I love your work and I, I love how well it's written and it's like a painting, it's like poetry. And at the same time, it teaches you about life, about history, about spirituality. And then at the same time, it tells you the conflict. Like, it's really re very well done. And it's not too big. You know, some books are so big and intimidating. And you're like, oh, I can't read this. It's too much. You know what I mean? So I thank you for that. Yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, let me hear your last words. And then I'll let you go and uh, continue the show. But I, I appreciate this so much. Now, my last word will be just especially in this uh, new uh, day, we are forgotten about, uh, uh, you know, uh, we are forgotten about, about uh, Corona. Uh, now they are trying to find a vaccine against Putin. So the thing is that let, let us not uh, be stuck on these things. Uh, let us not be stuck actually on uh, what they, they are calling uh, today the campaign or whatever. Because, you know, on one side they are talking about campa campaigning for something on the other side they said oh there is propaganda so there is no media anymore so there is only oh no th those are propagandists and then those are we are campaigning about something so the things that's the dangerous things about uh, uh, let us do our own things actually let us uh, let us not give them the, the power but let us make our own stories so that uh, they don't get too more power and i'm not listening too much to them uh, because then you get uh, again confused and you forget your own conflict back home or, or in your backyard that uh, you forgot how to, you can liberate uh, people around there. So let us uh, be, uh, as they said in Lingala, ekenge, uh, uh, faire attention. Hein? <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Let us know lost. what are our priorities. What are yeah, our priorities? It's, it's not know. our priority at all. Yeah. Because we have more priorities, you know. Mm. 
Nice. That I love that. Let's not lose focus on what is our own issue and what is our own priority. Yeah. All yes. right. Raiz Asante ni sana Asante ni Asante sana. sana. Mm -hmm. Nimeipenda ni sasa hii ma vitabu yako nimezipenda sana. Na hiyo mm -hmm. amani yani ni amani you know. <laughs> yeah, actually, asante, asante sana asante. kwa so, kwa leo yeah. urakoze. <laughs> urakoze. Eh, <laughs> yeah. Okay, we shall speak again. Thank you so much. Bye. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs> All right, my people. So that concludes the English um, part of this show with Rais uh, Neza Boneza. I love it so much. You can see his books, my people. Please buy his books. The one I have right here is Amani and uh, White Eldorado Black Fever. Uh, buy his books. So we're going to move on um, to the next uh, section of the show. Uh, we have a Rwandan musician and a Rwandan activist, and we're going to talk about um, more interesting things. So let me just close this part of the show so we can move on. Arama, people. <laughs> to my people okay 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 let me bring you one of my friends who is already here mimika gavo how you doing how you doing how you doing yo 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 okay so we are waiting also for jean paul samputu jean paul samputu i spoke to him before the show so i know he's coming and he's in studio already and uh, we're gonna start with him and uh, talking about uh, a topic that is, yo, Mimi Arikose, you're looking so good. What's happening? <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you, Louis. Thank you. <laughs> uh, you know, so uh, the question that Samputu is going to come and answer, and also everybody else can uh, participate um, on this question, is mm -hmm. what is the best way to commemorate the genocide against the Tutsi of Rwanda that happened in 1994. So we're not necessarily talking about our own experiences um, or, or anything like that. We are talking about um, the, the way that we have been commemorating. Is this mm -hmm. the best way that, that it leads to healing? You know? I see. Because ultimately what we want is healing healing for the victims and uh, maybe even redemption for the people who committed some sins, right? For mm -hmm. the people who participated in the genocide, even them, mm -hmm. they need healing, even them, they need redemption. So okay. the way that we've been commemorating, is this the best way that leads to that healing, you know? Mm -hmm. What do you think? What do you think? While we're waiting for sample to, to come, you know, we, we could be talking about it. <laughs> yeah. So, Louise, I find um, when something like genocide happens to a nation, it's, uh, it's like giving birth to a baby. We don't know. Uh, no matter how many people will tell you how to take care of a baby, you will really not know until the baby is there. So I find that what happened to us as Rwandans when it comes to genocide, it's exactly like that. We didn't know uh, how to heal. And we come from a country or a nation that does not, did not even understand what it is to, 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 to have a mental illness, to, to be able to speak. We come from places where they tell you that uh, when it's time to cry, when it's time to you feel a certain way, you go in the room, cry, then wash your face, come back, do not show your emotions, especially to um, the people who would not understand. So we did not know uh, where, how. So it was hard for us to know. That's why we went through the names, so many names of genocide. And there was sometimes retaliation. 
And people would uh, talk about it, even in front of us as kids. I remember right now, um, these days when I talk about the retaliation that happened, everything that I was told as a, as a kid, people say, oh no, FPL didn't do that. FPL came to save people, they never did that. Because at the time, it was a way that people felt like they were healing. They would talk about those things. But now we are trying to be political correct about anything and everything. As soon as someone talks about genocide, if you do not add against the Tutsi, there are so many people who will be coming for you because it is political to them. It's no longer about the healing. Everything has become the politics. And we think that after all of this time, we would know. We still have no idea. And for someone like me, as people would always tell me in the comments that had had time to mourn, that had talked about um, everything that happened to me, there was a time I felt as if uh, when, when I got to know everything else that happened after uh, the genocide against the Tutsi and all the war crimes, everything that happened in Congo, there was a part of me that felt like stop a little bit, stop talking about your pain, take time to hear about others. What does it mean that we should mourn all together? What is it that, why do we talk about the genocide against the Tutsi only when I am one of the people that say, what happened in Congo is a genocide. This, there was genocide against the Congolese, there was genocide against the Hutus. And myself as a Rwandan, I ask myself, why do we only talk about one genocide? Why can't we talk wait to until all of them have been, um, uh, UN has recognized them so that we can move forward. It could be one way, but really, is it the only way? What about the person who still, I, I find it weird that instead of us trying to find a way to heal, we are trying to be political. We are trying to teach each other how to go about it when we don't even know, you know? So it's, it's becoming, like the 28 years, you would think that it becomes easier. No, it's not. It's becoming so complicated and people do not even want to hear what the other person is saying, but they want to read the in-between lines. How are you calling this genocide? Which side are you? As soon as you, you talk about your existence and what happened to you, all of a sudden, you're this tribe, you're this ethnic group, you're... It's, no one wants to listen anymore. People are so hurt. And it is hard to answer that question. I don't think Absolutely. there's a best way. Yeah. Absolutely. I'm, I'm listening, though. I am listening. Mm -hmm. And today, I'm definitely going to listen. All right. So Samputu is here. Let me start the show. Let me start this part. And then I'm going to bring him into uh, the, the show. We're going to talk to him, hear what he has to say. And then I'm going to bring you uh, uh, after uh, after he speaks uh, as well. Thank you so much for being here, Mimi. Thank you. Appreciate Thank it. you, Louise. Thank you. All right. <laughs> Sabuto, are you ready? All right, my people, we have Jean-Paul Samputu. Uh, please take yourself off the mute. Jean-Paul Samputu, thank you so much for being here. We're going to do a little bit of uh, the conversation in English, and then we're going to move into Kiarwanda. The English section is only going to be for 20 minutes, 30 minutes maximum. And uh, Sam Putu, I'm so happy that you're here. I'm so happy that there was no press release separating you and I. <laughs> <laughs> this will, this can, this can happen to people who you preach. Know, right. You know, like the, the the thing is that you know we 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 can we can we don't have to agree. To, 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 you know, we don't have to always agree in order to have 
a civilized conversation and hear each other's thoughts. You know, we could be on completely opposite sides, but I can still listen to you. I can still listen to your ideas. Mm. You know, mm. it's like I don't have to be on the same side with you. I don't have to agree with you and everything, but we can still have a great conversation and listen to each other. So I appreciate that you're here today and I want your thoughts, your ideas on what is the best way to commemorate the genocide against the Tutsi of Rwanda that happened in 1994 and is the way that we have been commemorating leading to healing because as I was telling me in the introduction is like we need healing. We need healing for the victims we even need healing for the killers. We need redemption, you know, because even the killers, as Chizito Migo used to say, even the killers, uh, Chizito Migo and Nyo Mugabo had a discussion about it. Even the killers were sick in order for them to commit uh, the crimes that they committed. So even they need healing. So do you think, what do you think is the best way to commemorate the genocide against the Tutsi of Rwanda, according to you? Thank you, Luis. That's the, one of the questions I would like to, to have an answer. The best way to commemorate is commemorating in love. That's number one. The best way to commemorate is commemorating the way those we remember would love us to do. What our, our hours we lost, we, we remember. How they want us to remember them. We miss the point all the time when we, we, we do that. Uh, the best way to commemorate is to include in that commemoration the reconciliatory part. Many times we forget that. The best way to, um, to commemorate is to make sure that that commemoration, the way we do, will stop any future genocide. The best way to commemorate is to break the cycle of genocide, the cycle of violences, the cycle, the cycle, the cycle. The best way to commemorate is to preach what we think can, or what is really like. Um, I was going to now. I want to. I'm like. I'm going to attack a religion because I always attack them, and the people say, "Yeah, yeah, Jean Paul, you die. And you will die. You will die." I say, "I want to die. Uh, I would love to die." Saying the truth, please. Kill me. The religion, this religion, or you have seen, or even in the, in the past, everywhere. All the wars, all the genocide, always the religion was half, is behind. And as after when the problem comes, we ask, oh, religion can help us. How can you help a killer to come? Why you go to ask a killer to, to, to help you? He's going to kill again. That's why we have been having wars, wars. It has been all, and we never learned from the history. We go back now. Commemorating is to tell those people you think they are helping you to say, no, you have been failing all the years. Political, political. Actually, even the political. Mimi just said something very good. The politics you see we have. They cannot commemorate. They have been commemorating. <laughs> when you don't use pro politics of love, you cannot. Com the, your commemoration will not, will not be complete. No. So our children, who who will have to deal with all these problems, because in the future they are the ones. We always. In Kiyarwanda, they say it's a proverb, you know, that we somehow kwanga kuraganabi. You know that? What our ancestors has given us as heritage, 
They have given us these things to see. We live with. They have given us genocide. They have given us because all this we need. Now we are going to talk about that. I think it, I was going. Your question is good. I have like thousand answers. I'm telling you the truth because we need the healing, healing the transgenerational trauma caused by what? By the conflict that started even before us to be born. Our parent, our ancestors has not what they gave us as heritage is just this what we are living in those trauma the trauma trauma so we need a collective healing and that remembering that's what it was supposed to do they never do that because it's all political it's all religious they cannot that's why the remembering has not stopped it the genocide. Even now, if we don't do what we are doing now, it can happen on a genocide. The only way to heal this world politically, socially, psychologically, is the people to forgive. Now what I want to bring is the culture of forgiveness. Culture of forgiveness, it's the only way to remember to, to bring healing i, I think I, I let you talk because I, I have many answers i cannot finish just i'll stop there okay i hear you forgiveness okay so forgiveness is another topic that you and i disagree about because yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because so what is forgiveness <laughs> You know, like, what is forgiveness, you know? Uh, and then the Rwandan culture, is it realistic for for us to expect forgiveness in the Rwandan culture as it is? Because the Rwandan culture is about revenge. Let's face it, my people. Rwandan culture is about revenge. Someone does something wrong to you. They wanna, even your children, they will be told that story, as you have said we have inherited these things this is because of the culture of revenge because if your uh, parents can't do harm to someone they're like you have to remember these people are our enemies if you can then you are the one who is supposed to you know have that revenge you know even uh, at our neighbors uh, this man that i call sogoku museveni mm. and him he said that he named his son Muhozi mm. so that his son can be his avenger, you know, that he can revenge whatever he hasn't accomplished, his son can take over that. I find that that we have exact that spirit in, in the Rwandan culture, you know. So forgiveness, what is forgiveness? And where is this forgiveness going to come from? Let me first forgive you for not agree with me about forgiveness <laughs> i forgive you louise <laughs> i'm gonna you just gave me a verse to a song i have dedicated for you so i will put another verse saying that i forgive you <laughs> Okay, thank you. Forgiveness means to liberate from the bandage. Forgiveness means to release from our prison of hatred, our prison of revenge, because we just talk, said about revenge. Forgiveness means to release from anger, bitterness, resentment forgiveness is for you people think forgive many people think that forgiveness is for the other because he wronged to you no forgiveness is for you because you need to be released you need to be free from that anger you need to be free from hatred you need to be free from the sentiment 
So it, for, it is for you, actually, it's good to have that song I'm going to sing for you, which says, it, it says, you become what you don't forgive. In that song, I say, forgiveness is for you, not for your friend. Forgiveness. When I sing that song, I, I'll give you a testimony. People who hear that song, they have said, oh my God, now, is it for me? Oh, actually, yes. Because the enemy is not the other one who wronged you. The, your enemy is within you. Your enemy is your anger. The re, your real enemy is your bitterness. So you sleep with, you always with, you dance with, you, you always with that. So people don't know. When you know that you are living with your, your own enemy and you're cherishing your enemy, you're together, when that's why you need relief. When you say yes, I for, ah, okay, it's for me. Oh, I love myself. Let me forgive. Then you do that, you do self-forgiveness, then after you are free, free. So that now, the reason I said our ancestors, our uh, because what they did, they have they have just gave, given us the heritage of because. They didn't resolve their conflicts. So they keep transmitting their grievances and trauma to generation to the generation. The generation before our time have not hid from the wounds of the history, or from the wounds of genocide. What they do is what? You transmit to the other generation. And we find ourselves dealing with the conflict rooted before our time. You, are, you said something good. So it's a sake of revenge in the culture. People say, you just mentioned the people say, revenge. People think that it's a, to be brave, it's revenge. It's nonsense. Revenge is not, you are brave when you forgive, not to you. Because what you do, revenge is what you, you repeat. So you repeat what happened. So our responsibility now is to be good ancestors. How? When you implement the culture of forgiveness, because the only way you can avoid any future genocide, the only way you can break the cycle of violence, the only way is to, to, to absorb this culture forgiveness the only way revenge can you can you, the, the revenge it's like a spirit it's so bad that spirit and the people think they are brave because you beat me that i have to beat you that a man who is brave is the one who who do revenge now this is nonsense and it became a culture and the all and that's let me tell you something i told i, I did this in the un telling these people you call great leaders because their logic is, is revenge. You are president of a great nation and they say, let me attack. You attack, I'm gonna kill Bin Laden. Killing Bin Laden, you create millions Bin Laden. And after, you, you, don't, you don't reserve anything. So they go, they kill, kill for them, it's just, you know what we call intelligence emotional. Maybe we should talk about that later. Because these people, they're remembering, I will come back, they're remembering which, when it does not feed, feed the heart, that remembering we created that revenge. Because they, we keep feeding here. That's those people intellectual. The, 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 the leaders. That's why they are, sp see, every, any leader, any leader in the world, I, I, I know a few, but the majority, they have that spirit of religion. And they think, and you elect them, we always elect them, knowing they are going to, to, to do, they are going to change the world, they are going, but what they do is what? Because they have, they are not healed. They are, they are actually, they are sick. They are, they are, what the word to use? Because they, they have this spirit of revenge. That's what they think, because they think with this. They never think with that. 
they don't have this actually. Even if you are elected, you go there, you have that, you remove this, you, you are like this. That's why revenge is this, to have, <laughs> that's why they have problem. They need healing too. Thank you. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, so how many songs do you have? Should we bring in the song right now or should we go into the Kinyarwanda section or can we bring in the song and then after the song we go into the Kinyarwanda section? Yeah, I'm going to sing a song which will help you now to understand forgiveness and you'll be forgiving everyone who caused you problems. <laughs> I'll bring it up. <laughs> okay, let me bring Mimi on screen so she can enjoy this song with us. So. <laughs> <laughs> Mimi, welcome to the show. Sam Futu is here. He's about to do a song. We, we, we shall continue this conversation. You know, let's let's hear his song. After 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 we sing a, we sing a song about Mimi because she's wonderful. Yes, she is. <laughs> <laughs> You become what you don't forgive. You become what you don't forget. Forgiveness is for you, not for the offender. It is for you, not for the offender. Is not the other who wronged you. Your enemy is your bitterness. Your enemy is your anger. Your enemy is your revenge. Your resentment is your enemy. It is for you. Forgiveness is for you. It is for you. Forgiveness is for you. It is for you. Le pardon, il est pour toi. Il t'en rend ton honneur. Pas tant pas jusqu'au bonheur. Le pardon est pour toi. Et non pas pour Le fonceur, il est pour toi, pour toi, Louise. Il est pour toi, le pardon est pour toi. Il est pour toi, pour toi. Il est pour toi, Louise. Watchou. Il est pour toi, pour toi, pour toi. Il est pour toi, il te rend ton honneur, pas à pas jusqu'au bonheur. Il te rend ton honneur, pas à pas jusqu'au bonheur. Il est pour toi, pour toi, Louise Ouachou. Yo, bravo, bravo, bravo. I'm not going to say that you're not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do it. I'm not going to be able to do all right, my people, the end of the English part, okay? Everybody here learning Kinyarwanda right now, okay?
All right, all right, all right, my people. Okay, to Jesemu Chinyarwanda. Rero, turimo turibaza ngo ni ubuhe buryo twakora umuhango wo kwibuka kwibuka genocide yakorewe abatutsi birwanda muri 1994 hanyuma tukibuka twiyubaka. Ese uko kwibuka byagiye bibaho ni ibintu koko byatugejeje kukwiyubaka. Cyangwa uko kwibuka bibaho ni ibintu ahubwo bituma abantu baguma 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 bababaye 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 um and then ukabona abantu nge naoze mvuga nti tugomba guhindura uko twibuka kubera ko imyaka 28 yose irashize amarira ni yose ariko se umusaruro wayo marira uri hehe ese abantu barorohewe kubona ngo umuntu arakomeretse you know abanyarwanda uje kubona muri kuganira ukabo kubona ngo uramukomerekeje abantu ukabona barakomereka so easily ukabona abantu bari so fragile none ho ukibaza se ukuntu twibuka nibyo koko birimo kwiyubaka you know niba koko twibuka twiyubaka reka duhere kuri sambo tuvuko yararimo kuvuga hanyuma uh, na mimi azeho ariko ubu twageze mu kinyarwanda hanyuma rero turi bugaruke ni no kuri yo concept ngo yo kubabarira kuko uh, nyine mbonye byo kubabarira ibintu by'abanyarwanda super superficial nta abanyarwanda nzizeye abantu benshi bababariye bategezwe no kubabarira ibaze leti gategeka abantu ngo bababarire kubabarira muntu bikuva ariko leti kagutegeka ngo babarira kandi ukababarira kandi ukaje gukora video uvuga ngo wabariye ubwo sibyo ni ibiki you know ngaho rero sabu tunda kumva hanyuma na mikera hita tukuba bitekereza mmm kubabarira ngo ni nta bubitegeka ntibibaho nta nubwo bibitegekwa Eh, kuko kwa wale ni ni pasuna ok, si kiba zoro ni waru uvuza kuibuka vila kome chana kuko kuko kiba zoro kuko ndibu toneke abari wazi kuibuka kuko bikuye mbanje gusaba imbabazi kuko ni ibintu nabonye abantu bitondeka cyane ariko kuko biza kubohora abantu eh ukibingira na isesenga kuko nziko biratoneka iyo bivuze kuko nta nteka ko ari nubwa mbere hari bigiye kuvugwa kwibuka mbanze mvuge ko kwibuka tukora kwibuka mbona ntago gukwiye kwibuka byanya byo byagomeye ku guhagarika ibyatumye wibuka kwibuka gukwiye no kwibuka ese bari atwibuka bashaka ko twibuka gute uko twibuka ugira ngo niko bashaka nge navuga ntuya nkurikije imyaka yose tumaze twibuka Hago kwibuka ngewe ndafashe responsibility ndabivuze kuko nzi ibintu turimo iki kintu kini ni topic ikomeye cyane iruta nizindi zose zabayeho ngewe nzi nkora ama conference buri gihe ibirakomeye fashe cyemezo mbizire kwibuka ukora nakwemeza ko ndabivuze kubwanye ko ntabwo ariko abo twibuka bashaka ko tubibuka kuki kuko kwibuka bitari mu rukundo kwibuka bidatanga umurage wejo hazaza wabana bacu nimba bitari mu rukundo rwo mu mitima urukundo ni byinshi bavuga urukundo ndare ku rukundo rwo mu mitima kwiruka biturikana ubwoba se wajya kwibuka ufite ubwoba mu mutwe ubwo ntago kwibuka gushitse kwibuka nimba bitari mu rukundo nta ko kuhitse kuhibuka wutarimo ubgi yunji nagu kuhibuka nagu kuhitse kuhibuka kudakura hugu heran wana gahinda ugurumba nagu kuhitse 
kuko ubundi kwibuka hagomye kubamo kudaheranwa na gahinda abo nibuka bashaka ko mibuka gute ngewe nzi ko bashaka kubiyuka mu rukundo kubera iki kuko icyatumye bagenda niki mu ijambo rimwe ikintu cyatumye bicwa arwa gashinyagoro akicwa nabi niki urwango none ukuvuga nimbo shaka kubibuka no gukora ibyo bashaka irukana icyo kintu cyatumye bagenda niki se ikukirukana ni gute gukora do opposite no gukora igitandukanya nabi niki no rukundo urukundo ntirujya ruvugwa sinda bonu politiki uvuga urukundo rekada mukanwa ke aba politiki bose no kwisi nabari abakomeye nta numwe uvuga urukundo nta ushaka kuruvuga kuko ere ntago wavuga ibyo udafite ntago wavuga yandi twavugaga byo kwihorera nti wabu wavuga ukintu gitandukanye nibyo bikurimo no mu mutwe no mu mutima nene urimo kwihorera nibyo bikugenga nibyo urimo nibyo ubona politics yawe ni ibyo ngibyo ntago wabwira umuntu ngo fuguru kuna ntaro bafite akoresha umutwe adakoresha umutimbo byo twavugaga kwibuka rero nimba dushaka ko ejo hazaza habaheze twibuke mu buryo buvuri bikomere byatewe namateka ntagwa wabikora uhubwo ugarura agahinda ugarura Arawan wari fieri igihe cyo kwibuka kigeze ndabaza imishuti zanyu bakaba fieri kutukana bakaba fieri ngo ziranya na zimba sha za tugeze bakaba fieri bakumva vraiment baranishimiye ngo giye kirageze cyo gutuka sha igihe kirageze cyo igihe kirageze reka sasa reka tubereke igihe kirageze cyo kwihorera kuko kwihorera si ukubikora guse no mu magambo no mu bitekerezo no mu namagambo uvuga message zagombye kuva ikintu mu kigeze cyangwa iki ntazindi zagomye kuba message zivura ibikomere zagomye kuba message zizana ikizere zagomye kuba ubutumwa eh bujyana nejo hazaza kuko reba naboze mvuga ngo ijana mu gihe mukimwe mu 94 kugeza ubu imyaka 28 ishize ni imyaka kwera abantu bavutse cyangwa bakuze mu cyo gihe nimaka abantu bihahamukiye barahamutse kandi kwibuka yije buri gihe nudahamutse ahita hamuka uzabirebe twabyo yagiye mu kwibuka nandi rimbye mu mu byo kwibuka cyane imyaka myinshi twa yatubikora na kizi to za ndirimbo zo kwibuka twaraze ikora gahuri imaka tugahimba ndirimbo menda wona ga ibintu biba na mavuga kubabarira naza na kubabarira akaba intambara kuko ni wo mutu bundi nageze naho mbabwira nti nimba urwaye kwa muganga bakaba mbere ko baguha umuti urwaye nk'igiye nuko bya bya bimeze na barongera bakakujomba barakujomba kujomba niki kugira ngo ukire urarwaye kandi ha handi kugira ngo ukire bakureme barakujomba tu sasa rero forgiveness ni cyo ngicyo kubabarira ni bakujomba kugira ngo birakurya ariko biragukiza numutu ba ukari numutu sharira numutu rujyana ariko numutu kiza uremera ukabikora bakakujomba ubibona kuko ziko bigukiza ni kimwe nibindi nigeze gutangira sizi nabaye bire birosha kongera kuvuga cyangwa na washa kumba ziki bika nguru gero ikintu nakoze nige na nabitangiye mu Rwanda dayer yageze mu cyunamo nabigire ni kibazo cyo gihe fata umuntu wishe papa tutanga ubuhamya mu cyunamo yarambahana meza ari byari ibintu tutanga ubuhamya tujya no kuri BBC bo ni ibintu bizwi nta nubwo ari ibintu tuvuga avuga kuri wishe papa nange uvuga kuri namubabariye tukora conference muri la Paris bwaro bwa mbere mbere yabantu mu bihumbire bona mu bare mu bihumbire na birindwe nagiye muri gacacha nge nabo bari muri gacacha nabo nabo bari mu muri gacacha imbere yabantu aho aho nvukira nabantu baraho ahari na wahari yavuye muri prison bo bari mbone nkubwe none duhita cyo giye nagize amatake baranya turaducicete tukaya tubikora rwihishwa mu bihumbire no munani tujya mu mashuri mu bihumbire ni kenda ndavuga no forgiveness imana yari duhaye tugomba kwikora hamagara bibis magara ma televiziyo tukora conference abantu bava muri America bakiya naje nitwaje 
abazungu ko nabagamba muri America cyo gihe mu babari imbere y'abantu bose avuga uhamya nanye ndavuga ndamubabara kandi mu cyunamo kubera ko ruri mu cyunamo ye 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 abari scapé rero ishuti zange abo twabanye bose akoza abantu ni mu mwice nago bishoboka barano amvuga cyo gihe ibuka wayoboraga ibyo yaravuga ati Jean Paul ni umupfobye wa genocide umuntu bira mujya mwumva ngo umuntu wawe wa mbere bavuze ko ari negationiste ni yewe noneho cyo gimana yaduhaye imbaraga gukomeje na Vincent kuko iyo bavuga ngo iyo bikora atari mu cyunamo noneho biba nahimbye indirimbo yitwa Never Again nabahanzi benshi bavuye Kenya bavuye kora ko nagomba iyo ndimo yagomba kuba yagomba yari yari yiki kinini cyane ndayikora ariko ameme ta vense nabwo tukakora for givenness ariko twibuka kadukora indirimbo kandi nge nayihimye nge nakoranyije abaririmbye bose ati subutugeza guti indirimbo turayanga kandi mbikorera ha indirimbo irahita ubuhamya bwo kuba bara burahita bibisi bihitisha ibi buri mwanya ariko ubwo tuba turaranshije ariko ubwo abantu banwanyaga leta yarashigiki kuno bikoze na leta ishyiramo n'amafaranga komisiyo y'ubwinjye ari kumwe nange kuko barabishaka babona ari ibintu bizima koko kandi tumva ari ibintu bya komisiyo y'ubwinjye wari fatuma ndangiza yari utegeka komisiyo y'ubwinjye arashigikira komisiyo y'ubwinjye nanono ya genocide yari mucyo ampa n'amafaranga cyo gihe miliyoni imbe zarenye tukore conference tukore ibintu komisiyo y'ubwinjye bari bahari no kwitangiza fatuma ndangiza utegeka komisiyo y'ubwinjye yarahari Pia mira wa hi, pigi ndanes, forgiveness si, ugo abanu ni ramachu mimi bichi bjo sisi arabani, no na ho abani, aba aba hutu na bo, baka baka bira fesi ngo ya ngo na kazi kwa ushanga biuri mo, ngo na kazi kwa unguji uli rever, ngo na tuwa rese ba tuwa tuwa kazi, no no fesi ajira atergo machu mu, na na ba hutu, bumba kubari inhera kuhari inhera hamga hamga ngo na kazi kwa uzawa uli rever. Nanjye abatuze ngura tugura tugambaniye ngo ibyo bintu nibiki urabare ngo uratanga itege kuri yo kubabara ngo se no eh ni ntambarira ba inambarira ba turakomeza uko batubwe twitukomeza ari ngo kuri imbaraga zo kubabarira nta muntu ushoko kugira ngo uje kubikora wakuye mu bwo nta waje muri gacaca ufite ubwo byose wawe ikoye ndakubwiye ko byabaye resit abazungu baje muri yo nama baza bavuga ngo ibi nibyo byiza ibyo rwanda rukene governor yarabishyike byari bye nta kibazo numwa kukurikiraho indi myakurikiraho turonyira ndabazana tukora fu nanone reconciliation ko ya yitwa ga healing the wounds of history za ndabazungu mu 30 noneho komisiyo y'ubwinjye bishyigiki ibyakurikiye uko kurwanya bikarwa abantu bakabirwanya ariko tugakomeza no ugasanga dufite turi bake ariko dufite imbaraga kubarusha so dufite imbaraga kuko twe twari hararutswe ntutinya gupfa muzo abenshi batinya gupfa nge singa ntinya gupfa so iwo wagize imbaraga zo gudatinya gupfa kuko deje narapfuye ntago wapfa kabiri narapfuye kuzo ranyica ngo ngo ndakwica gute se konzi ko ndapfuye uranyica kabiri so nuko nababwiraga abambazaga bose ibyo byo kwa rabiza gukoraho mu magambo make nabivuze mu cyongereza nahanga nimba hatari uyu mwuka wo kubabarira ngo tujemo wavuze neza ruze wavuze ikintu gikomeye ngo 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 kwihorera ngo biri muri marasu ngo nibyo nimba hatari hatari ikintu kikuyemo ari ya marasu yanyu wavuze jambo nakunda redemption nimba hatari ikintu gikura ibyo bintu uyo muka mubi wo kwihorera hataba ikintu ki opposite kibikura izayongera ibije mu sita kizongera da None se wakuye hiki itera kitara n'urwango uri gipro ntabwo wagikuye iraba iraba rwose ndarangije Mhm reka nkubaza kabazo kamwe mbere yuko ngira icyo mbaza mimi Yes None se ubwo wababariye ari wowe bikuvuye mu kumutima cyangwa wababariye kubera ko leta nayo ibishyigikiye kandi biri muri gahunda ya leta urumva na leta iragusa potins eske ni biba bikuvuye mu kugiti cyawe cyangwa umuna nabikoze kuko nyine leta ibyemera kandi bijyanye nanone na gahunda ya leta oya cyo gihe leta yaranatunguye yari garugamera babona umuntu 
um 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 ntabwo <laughs> banja na kumusuzi kumvuza ngiye gupfa na umuntu ushaka kwiyahura gato nkanga ko gaha ubuhamya nari nakufuye no njya kumusuza na abantu banasengera gena umuntu utemera imana ntabwo nayi usuko nayiririmye ngo bimaze iki kubaho usuko rezo ndi bimo nagiraga nayi bwa mana waruri kukiweme ko abantu bapfa vuga ngo imana yo mana nari umwari w'abantu ngo muri mbe maze iki kubaho ndavuga ngo sini yeze nsaba kubaho sini yeze nsaba ngo undeme habyo nagusabye kuki se ba nazira ko napuye nazira ko kuki nazira ko ndi kuki nimba mugenzo wanyi atishime ko ndiho kuki bimaze iki kuba none banyana ku musozi ndi aho nkize habi gitangaza nkaje numvishwe iryo jwi ryambwe kubabarira ngo nta kintu kinyiza no kubabarira ni mbabarira uwo niki nta babarira nabandi nanye ngasaye mbabaza uno hemuki ndahita nke wo ni wo warumute bimaze kuba rero binjamo marameze tatu ndagende ngo nagiye muri gacaca Jamu rika chachu ndari koro. So kuwa wale rebu yu mbazi kukusu mizi kiwa zo chavini. Hali ya gata ya njene ya maa. Kandi ya rana nteje tse. Na wafu Amerika. Nari meze neza. Amerika. Nari fita ba mula ya fiti kim fiti mezo. The disc nara te infutkura maturu. Ndabine kapitio kusimu mbe nabine nge mburu wano. Kani nge na mburu chacha. Kani nani itegwe wupu. Na narazi. Ndabi kugi. Na abivuze. Ni ikiba kibe ndagiye ariko nkore b'Imana yambiye ndagiye na bafata versa byose nene nabanje no kujya muri prison kumushaka ngo bimubwiye ko Imana yambiye kubabarira kujya muri tujya muri gaca tu ariko birarangira so nti hagati yange ni Imana rero kandi ikindi kugira ngo mbikore Imana yabanze gukura mu bwoba nta gushaka kujya gukora ibyo bintu ubwo banze kubukuraho so dire mu mpamvu byabaye 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 successful karabaye kana mbaraga zibintu byikada zari mbaraga z'Imana zikorera gusa so nibyo mhm okay reka twumve nanone na mimi icyo bitekerezaho mimi wakoze cyane kuboneka muri iki kiganiro um none wowe ubona uko dusanzwe twibuka ari ibintu bizadufasha gukira kwiyubaka koko cyangwa se ubona uko twibuka mbega byifashe gute um hanyumbo gundi nkoboje gatoya kubyo sampute aba yavuze ngo gatoya harakantu nigeze gupost ejo bundi kavuga ngo um abantu bo mwijuru abo bantu bacu twibuka niba tunazi cyangwa twemera ko bagiye mwijuru koko mwijuru ni muri dimension bumva amahoro no munezero gusa mba se niba rero twebwe twibuka turi mu marira turi no mu kababaro eske abo bantu mu ijuru ntabwo ntabwo tubageraho kuko ntabwo tugera kuri level yacu kuko bo bibereho mu mahoro no munezero n'uko twebwe turi mu kababaro turi no mu marira dushobora mbega no kutazigera duhura nabo kandi ari bo twibuka rero mbira wowe ubona yuke uko abantu basanzwe bibuka hanyuma ese ubona aho icyakorwa kurusha ko ari ikihe hanyuma ubwo yenda no shaka no kuvuga kuri ibyo byo kubabarira nabyo wabivugaho nuko nyibwirira ah urakoze cyane Louise mbere yo kuvuga ku kwibuka nagira ngo juste mvuge mu kubabarira kubera yuko hari ikintu Jean Paul Samputi yavuze numva we ikintu yababariye byari organic yarabyisabye ariko ikintu mvuga cyo muri ibi bintu byo kwibuka no kubabarira nuko iyo babigize politique n'icyo kintu cyo kumva ngo commission y'ubumwe n'ubwiyunge yahise bifata nje mba numva ibyo bintu bitari byo kubera yuko it's one thing kugira ngo babarire ubitangira ubuhamya ariko noneho kugira ngo wabitangira ubuhamya ukavuga ibyiza byakubayeho n'ukuntu wakize abandi bantu nabo wenda bakaba bageraho organically nkuko nawe byakubayeho kubera yuko niba biba byabaye hagati y'umuntu n'Imana cyangwa se umuntu we wenyine akumva ashaka gukira ni ni hagati ye nawe ariko ntago numva haba hagomba kugira ngo commission y'ibi nibi ihite it's one thing gufata ibiganiro mpa bya bindi twajya gatubona bya ba 
niyo mugabo na bakizito it's one thing kuba bashiraho iyo icyo kintu cy'ukuntu samputu n'umuntu wamwikiye bababariranye ariko none ho kubifata bakabishya bagasa nka babitegetsa abandi niho byapfiriye ntago kubabarira byigeze na rimwe bibikibazo ahubwo kuba iyo babigize politike bagashaka kubigira kubigira ngo bibe nkaho ari inkoni yo kutugeza ahakurikiyeho nico kibi kandi ngiye kubabarira kutagira justice sinkwemera nemera kubabarira ko ari ukwanje ariko nanone kuko ibibi byose cyangwa ibyiza dukora muri yisi numva ko twagobye kugira consequences zabyo kuri yisi mba numva kubabarira na justice bigomba kuba handi ntandi urakoze kucyo kwibuka rero ikintu cyo kwibuka nge mbona hari indirimbo yabagaho na sinzi niba narayikunda gwa cyangwa yankoraga ku mutima genocide ikirangira yajya bivuga ngo hold on harya yavugaga ngo kingo ngo kuna nanena ya nabane tabatiriho ngo yebutse urwanda nyoberwa hondi like iri ya ndirimbo at that time at that particular time mbese mbona nka buri mwaka cyangwa buri gihe gishize hari ikintu twari dukeneye umwaka wa mbere nyuma ya genocide kumva izo ndirimbo ukarirukagira gute yes umwaka wa kabi like twagombaga kugira ukuntu tugenda dusa nkabava ha iyo iyo bashaka kubigira ibintu by'igihugu cyose nka kuri yabatubwira ngo uyu mwaka ndashaka ko mwibuka gutya uyu mwaka murafunga business muze bigende gutya like ayo mategeko iyo bashaka kuyaduha bari kuzajya batuvana muri kakababaro bagenda bakora umaze kubona za ndirimbo kizito yaririmbye akavuga ati ubwa mbere naririmbye gutya ariko kuko niba tutiga niba umujinya nagahinda nibiki nari fite muri 95 bigenda byikuba akaba ari byo nkifite muri nyuma uh, y'imyaka 28 ndibeshya cyane kandi niba nibuka nikunda aho kugira ngo ni nibuka mite nibuka ha hantu nari ndi nibuka nsha kuri nyabarongo mbona imibiri y'abantu irimo noneho sinshake kugira ngo numva abandi muri bwa buntu tujya tuvuga ngo ndiho kukuriho numve undi muntu waciye nko muri Kongo avuga ibye ntihagira icyo binkoraho ngo kuko nguri yari umusaraba wabo ngo ariko nje wanje ngo nibo babitangiye ngo byagenze gute ngo ubundi mwajyaga muri Kongo wabyishye wabyishye kandi niba uri muri buka ntago twagombye nje ubwanje uko nshaka kwibuka uyu mwaka ni gute gushobora kuba ariko umwaka utaha byagenda none se niba bibaye itegeko ryo kuntu tugomba kubikora cyangwa se ubwumvikane bw'abantu babavuze bati uyu mwaka biragenda gutya noneho umwaka utaha ngiye nkumva sinshaka no kubijyamo ndashaka wenda kwicara ngo ndire eske ndashaka kwibuka umuntu wanje nkora nk'ibyo wavuze uti bari mu munezero ntago baba bashaka ko duheranwa na gahinda nta nubwo imyaka yose yagombye gusa twagombye kutabigira ikintu cy'ambere cyabyishe nuko ibintu byo kwibuka birambabaza kubivuga gutya yuko mbona babifashe nk'iturufu bagafata iyo genocide akaba ari nka yo mugati akaba ari yo bashyira imbere kugira ngo umuzungu navuga bahite bavuga bati hold on mwari muri he mwari muri ha batutsi bapfa so mbona ari cyo kintu cyabyishe kikabiremereza cyane kigahora bisa nkaho babika hariya mureka tuzahatabura igihe kintu iki amagufa ajya horaho hajye hahora hari cya kintu cy'ububabare n'uburakari nico cyabyishe nico cyabyishe ariko iyo biza kuba organically tukazajya buri muntu wese akumva yuko umuntu wari uwe ariko nanone akazana mu muntu nkumva nundi sinumve yuko abo twari turi kumwe kabwa yigusa cyangwa mu petite sœur de Jésus cyangwa se ngabo ngo dufite amateka amwe ngo dusangiye ibiki ngo ari bo bababaye gusa nta twari kuba twaramaze gukira twari kuba tugeze ahantu hatangaje twari kuba biriya bintu bimeze nka theatre abantu bakina ubu ngo ubu twari kuba twicara tukabona tukabibonamo ikintu gitangaje ni mu mbabare ya gato ndabahurugero rw'ibintu byambayeho nkejo cyangwa ejo bundi ruhumuza ruhumuza mbonye umutwa sinzi ko muzi ukuntu abantu bajya bamutuka bakamutuka bakamutuka kabihorera gasobanura kasobanura noneho haza kugera ahantu umuntu ngo aza kuri page yege ntago nabonye ibintu yanditse anyandikaho ngo ibintu bibi biteye ubwo no selma ngo yabisibye yaragiye ara mu bloka aza no ku no muri inbox kumbira ati umbabarire umuntu yagutukiye wanje ariko ndabisibye ndamublotse tavuga ni is this the guy birirwa batuka buri munsi like like can you imagine if we were those people eh? 
niba nakushyira ku ruhande nkagenda yagize wari kugira ngo isi yacitse ibintu byageze tuvuga ni what none se we ari immune kubitutsi kuki nkumva abantu tugiye tumera gutyo ubu ngubu ntago ntago twari kuba dufite ikibazo ya pan africanism tuvuga twari kuba twarayigezeho iyo tuza kumva abagenzi bacu tukabonera really ikibazo aho kiri cyane cyane ko tugeze muri 2022 tubona ibintu bya covid ejo tukabona bya ukraine tukabona abanyamakuru bicaye barimo baravuga ngo bari abantu bafite des yeux bleus comme nous bafite imisatsi meze nitwongere ngo tugire gusya ngo tuvuge ngo hold on hari kibazo hano anyway navuga sindangize ariko wakoze cyane kuntumira kandi iki kintu ni ikintu umuntu yavuga akaba passionate akajaza na mibindi bintu nibindi ariko reka masubize ijambo Louise merci merci urakoze ikintu uvuze gitangaje ni ukuntu uvuzemo n'izina by'umuntu uvugwa kuri televiziyo y'u Rwanda mu bantu batibuka banakobya ubwo kumba ora mu buzimo buze neza urumva se kandi koko nibyo ruhuza mbonye ubutwa rwose ni imfura ariko wajya kumva ukumva muri iyi sezon yo kwibuka kuri televiziyo y'u Rwanda bari kwibuka ariko ni ngaho ubwo nta nikintu bibuka ubwo bo bibereye muri politike barimo baranataka nabantu bakareba nk'abantu banenga leta bakabonera aho umwanya wo kubata urumva se ariko really nta nta kintu umuntu abona ngo barimo bibuka nyabyo bega birasekeje ko wowe uvuze umuntu kuri televiziyo y'u Rwanda bavuga ko twagombye no nko kwibagirwa none ukabona namwibutse ikindi rero navugaho ni iki kintu cyo kuvuga ngo amahoro n'umunezero ni wo ubyi na muntu ufite ubasha ngo kugukomeretsa iyo ukomeretse ese koko bibara amakosa y'umuntu waje kugukomeretsa cyangwa bibara amakosa yawe kuko ni wowe utarabashije gukora terapi no no ni wowe unana komereka umuntu mbega kakugiraho ubwo bubasha bwo kubasha kugukomeretsa ntago wagombye wagombye kwiyuka wiyubaka yubuza kuba wiyuka wiyubaka koko wari yubatse ntago umuntu wawe wese ya ubwo bubasha bwo kuza ngo gukomeretse reka rero nongere mere kuri wowe mimi umbwire ese wowe hari ikintu ukora kigukomeza waha nabandi none ho rero abantu bagakomera ntibaje batonekara so easily kuko ubona abantu batonekara so easily ese wowe icyo yo level wari wayigera none ho ya mbona Mhm. Mm Louise mbona duhora turi kuri mode ya defense. Duhora turi ready yo kurwana. Kuburyo iyo umuntu yanditse ibintu cyangwa se umuntu akagira ikintu avuga ntabwo tujya kubireba ahubwo tujya kureba ubivuze tukajya kureba uko tumwataka nitu ntubisobe ngo wumve ngeje bundi byambayeho uh, navuga na kuri poste wakoze yagiye ama commentaire menshi cyane. Uh, wanditse nsigaye na, narize gusoma ibintu nakuyeho uwabivuze which nabyo naje kubona ngo kuri ya poste yawe yuko iyo umuntu ari umuntu usa nkuwigisha rimwe na rimwe ugomba kumugarura aho kugira ngo uvuge kuti ah ndabona impamvu ndabese ndabona impamvu byagenze gutya na gutya na gutya ndishimye ko nakuze muri cyo kintu uvuga cyo kutagira umuntu kugira ubundi iyo nyibona wenda cyera hashize nko mwaka ntabwo nari gusubiza nkuko nasubije Nari, nari kuba nanjye ndi muri mode yo kuvuga ngo hold on bigenze gutya uvuza ibi ngo ntitwibuye uko iki ese ibintu nk'ibyo ariko mu gukura kwanje nubwo ntari nabonye isomo riri buzemo nyuma waje gutanga ariko narabifashe mbifata mbibona mbi nsubiza ikibazo wabajeje aho kujya kukwataka aho kujya kubona mibindi so ibyo bintu kugira ngo kure ni hahandi wavuze umenya yuko amahoro nitwe tuyiha ibintu byose iki ni cyari cyo cyose umunsi tuzavuga ngo i'm not going to respond kubyo banyita nza respondinga kubyo nibwira nta kintu kizava hanze kizampungabanye ntago bibura yuko akantu gato kaza kakagukoraho ari kukongera ukajya kwiganiza ukivugishwa buguti uzuriwe niba umuzi umusobanukiwe nta kintu na kimwe umuntu wo hanze azaza ngo akore ngo gihungabanye aho nahagaze 
kuko hari ahantu umuntu aba yaravuye naho yageze nta kintu rero ngewe numva cyagombye kuduhungabanya ahubwo iki kintu cyo guhora turi muri iyi mentality y'aba victime nicyo tugomba kuvamo tukagisezera burundu tukava mu no no tukaba victorious no kugira ngo abandi bantu bazaza nyuma abari twe tuzabafasha cyane cyane iyo twagize imana tukagera muri ibi bihugu bikwigisha therapy bikakubwira ko atari mbi ahubwo bikakubwira yuko ziranatandukanye hari therapy ishobora kuba nziza nk'iyo kumva abantu baganira numvise umugabo waruri kuganiriza kare ibibazo wa mubazaga ukuntu atahitaga abifata ahubwo yasha yashakaga accountability akavuga ati ngiyewe ntabwo naje kugira ngo ntunge intoki ata ahubwo mba nshakisha ibisubizo aho kugira ngo nicare ngira gutya na gutya ngo kongo byagenze gutya kongo no ndareba nkavuga ngo ni gutaba abantu batwinjije kugira ngo bari abazungu tuvuga ngo baje bakadukoloniza bakaducama ibice nitwe twabahaye icyo cyuho ni gute none ngo twaba ugasanga aho kugira ngo tunge intoki ari marafata ya accountability ibyo bintu nibyo bizatuma tuba victorious aho kugira ngo duhore turi aba victim nicyo kintu tugomba kwiga muri iyi myaka izaza tugiye kumara indi myaka 30 nabandi bazamare wenda 30 cyangwa iya zaba 60 simbizi tukiri muri ibi tugomba kugera ahantu tuvuga tuti niyo hari ikintu nakundaga ku bantu b'Israeli hari ahantu ngo bavugaga ngo niyo ntazagera kanani ariko natwe tujye tuvuga tuti niyo hazagera ahantu ciwe mu Rwanda Burundi sinzabashe kugera ariko naho ndi muri uru Rwanda zaba narihesheje agaciro mu kugira ngo buri munyarwanda wese aho ari mbe narashyizeho cyakintu kimeze nk'iteme ari cyo kizito yazize ari cyo bani yo mugabo bazize ese ni duhora turyana gutya dupfusa ibi bintu bikwibuka bikaza tugahebera rwa rwango tukarugumana byagera mu kwa gatatu rugaturika ngo kwa kane kwageze ampaye kuze habaye iki habaye iki kuki kuki bigomba guturika icyo gihe nicyo kinyereka ko biri fake biba biri fake ntabwo ushobora kugira ukwezi ni tariki uturika jamais yes wakwibuka kuvuga kuti nari ndi he yande hari utuntu wagira ariko ntabwo wahebera urwango numujinya ngo biturike icyo gihe eh ruwi fata ijambo ni fata ri shimute naho ubundi iki kiganira ni cyarangira nako cyarangira okay reka nkibarize sampu turero sampu to ba wikuye kuri minute mo gatoya ese uh, wowe nk'umuntu wigeze kujya uh, mu nkotanye ese ubona icyo kintu iyo ubwiye abantu ko uri numucika cumu ko uh, umuryango wawe wahuye ikibazo ese habaho icyo kintu cyo kukubwira ngo wari mu nkotanye kuko hari abantu benshi hari imiryango myinshi nayo yishwe muri genocide bazira ko bafite bene wabo uh, mu nkotanye ese ako kanu kigeze ka kubaginga mu mutima uvuguti you know bene wacu yera bazize ko nagiye no mu nkotanye numva se cyangwa se wumve ngo ngo ngufite guilt muri wowe mbega ubyi ubyi sobanura rute ubyi sobanura rute hanyuma nabakubona uri muri ibingibi babyakira bate babyakira bate hanyuma wowe wabashije ute kubinavigatinga ukabugeze kuri uh, level uh, ugezeho um, hanyuma eh, ukavuga tugaruse kubyo kubabarira ese wowe wumva hari ibyo ufite usaba abandi imbabazi kuko at the same time kubabarira se nindu babari rundi nindu babari rundi nindu babarirwa ese uwo muntu nkubwo ngugiye kujya kumubabarira akakubwira ati ntabyo nshaka nta nibyo nkeneye wabigirute ni byiza iki kibone sibaze kiza cyane kuko baje ni byambaye ko dayera wishe data ivensa nyine kuko twanabivuganye yo abantu mwiyunze muravuga na byose ni bibazo ya bamubwiraga baravuga ngo wishwe n'umuhungu wawe tujye kwica ku muhungu wa riri midiri mu kuri muhabura turazumva n'umuhungu wawe kuko gye n'ubundi impamvu na nashaka kwiyahura nuko numvaga nishe ni gye nishe data Donc, kuri je nunwa gana li shedat ka narabi ya miraga kwa rupi. Ya zize jeo. Nijo na vuga. No ni horero, ikini gise, sinzi ni mbozi, ikini kini muhame ya ganje jeo, kina kome ichani. Na mfitu mwana, na biyara njino mkogo wa kajenza. Kajenza yari suprefe wa, wa, wa ruhe njiri. Ise umu hutu, mama waro mtuti. 
tubyara numwana yavutse ku itariki ya gatatu zo kwa gatano iyo mu kimwe arakina 90 intambara iba afite imyaka itatu noneho we bagiye kumwica muri genocide arababwira ati no yende umuntu kazamurangisha gute ati wabyaranye na Jean Paul Samputo yishwe mbese nawe nange namwishe ibyo niko navuga icyo gihe kandi koko nibyo koko ura we no no ni umuhutu kazi nti yagomba gupfa yaravuga ati gende umuhutu kazi abantu bagi impaka hari abantu hano bari bavuga no 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 ngo we ni umuhutu kazi ni uwacu nago tumwice aravuga ati yabyaranye n'inyenzi ivuga kuri radio muhara n'ubu mugende mu ruvi ndirimbo ibyo niko bavugaga noneho bati bati mwica umwa ati no twica umwa no kuko umwana wasanguye abandi baravuga bagi impaka kumwica uno no bagi impaka akababwira ati no ni munyicura umwana abandi ati no twica umwe na tumureke Muruko kuvunga baba barabishe bose Paula Kagenz yazize yegebo Samhutu azira yegebo Mukwa kubabarira byo nakubwiraga Imana yabanje nabanje kwibabarira Nibyo navuka kabyanyi ya ndirimbo mbavuga ibyanyi forgiveness is for you not for the offender Kuba bare bifasha wowe Urabanze ugakora for forgiveness no nukajya kubabarira abana ntuwaha ukanabyigisha ko ntuwaha abana ibyo dafite uko byageze rero nuko nguko kugusubiza ikibazo cyawe naho ibyo bavuga ngo harugicanye wakoze gewe ni hago wababarira kino ngo reke kubabarira kiriye kandi ibyo abanyarwanda twirirwa mu twirirwa twishonda nango bicya na gutya gutya umuntu numuntu umuntu azaba umuntu azakora makosa azagira ate ikigomba kuba twese buri muri agomba kwireba buri munyarwanda se agomba gukora introspection kisuzuma hanyuma twirwa turegana wango bari yango namwe nibi mujya mu mutuka mutuka bayobozi mubireke kuko muri ani ko niko kwica kwawe iyo kumuyobozi arakora kazi kana we kora kawe ariko uyu mutuka ntumutukira iki kuko ni husanga usanga umuntu yaya nayo byatabize wo umunwa wawe no kuhesha umugisha nago ro gutukana usanga ro twese turi muri ibyo ya revenge wavugaga niyo abadashoye kwica ariko baricha na manu numunwa baratuka ni mu kwera iki turakira ibikomere abanyarwanda uzarebe 80% tujyana na post traumatic syndrome na hanga muri Canada turi 1890 bararwaye abantu barabibi yabikubwira abantu bagenda barwaye warona abantu bagenda ariko bararwaye turarwaye kuko ntabwo bavuga nguri muzima kandi warabavutse mu bikomere uvutse mu bikome mu ntambara uvutse mu muri ibyo ubikuranye nyine urarwaye koko siwo kandi bibabwiye basha kwihagaraho ngo singwa murarwaye byo bavuga ngo harya ni ndu bubabarira ndi nyine ni ndu vura ndi ko twese turwaye ufete burabivuze ariko nyi ibyo nyine niyo mpamvu imbabaza ari ngombwa niyo mpamvu gyewe sukwirata sukwivuga niyo mpamvu nge mvuga umuti ntabwo nge mvuga ibindi vuga umuti umuti no imbabazi wabishaka utabishaka ni imbabazi wakoza amakosa nasaba imbabazi mu kwihana ni wakoza ukose yihane undi na ubabarire period bitari ibyo genocide zongerebe bitari ibyo amahana zongerebe mhm mhm ubuzi cyo gutukana nita nibuko kuntu abayobozi burwanda bubwabo bakunda batukana urumva se bagenda kubwira urubyiruko bajya kubwira ngo murebe bakababwira ngo mujye kureba batukana bakababwira nge sinshobora kuvuga amazina yabo abantu batukana urumva se bakoresha nibitutsi ariko ukajya kumva kumva umuyobozi aravuze ngo muzaje gukurikira kanaka kandi wo kanaka no umuntu tukana no umuntu tukana bya hatari rero ugasanga ese nabayobozi nabo barashaka abantu batukana bakunda batukana iyo batutsenda ni nabwo bakumva simbizi nimi urabivugaho iki ibyo sampu tavuze ikure kuri mute Murakoze murakoze na ka ibyo abayobozi gukunda abatukana ni nayo mpamvu bibuka aho kugira ngo bibuke bigisha abantu kwiyubaka bakabigisha kujya gutangira izindi ntambara kubi burwango ibyo byo iyo politike rwose yo mu Rwanda yo niko imeze nta kindi yifuza irifuza gutanya ibyo bintu byo kubabarira wowe Samputu abivuze neza ati ubabarira ni wagize gute ariko mu Rwanda ntaga ariko babibona ahubwo babwira abantu ngo numwana wabaravutse numwana utaragize gutya kubwabo baba bumva ngo kugira ngo tube ndu munyarwanda mwiza ariko tubanze tugahagara tukaba batutsi nabahutu umuhutu agasaba imbabazi ngo zabatutsi kavuga kuti se ibi bintu bizagerahe none se ko tujya twiyemerera yuko 
nubwo tudashaka kwemera ko habaye genocide yakorewe abahutu ariko twiyemerera ko habaye des crimes de guerre none se iyo uri murabwira uwo mwana uwo mwana wenda akaba yarabuze se muri yo crimes de guerre ubushaka ubugira ngo we asabwe imbabazi nande <laughs> ni imana nawe avuga ati bimaze iki kubaho so icyo kintu nicyo tugomba kwivanamo yuko hari ubwo kubu nubu ugomba gusaba ni imbabazi cyangwa se tukajya kuri zo defense zo kumva ko niba mvuze genocide yakorewe abatutsi biya bivuze yuko yakozwe n'abahutu ntabwo ariko bimeze kuba ariko yitwa ishobora no gukorwa n'abatutsi kandi yarakorewe abatutsi so ni ni tujya kuri yo defense yo kuvuga ngo umunsi uh, genocide yakorewe abahutu ngo yemewe ngubwo ngubwo ngo bizaba bibaye match ni oya umuntu ni umuntu iyo twibuka bacu ntabwo ntabwo ari cyo kintu cya politique ntabwo ari cyo kizina cyaje kitwa genocide gusa ahubwo nabantu bacu so ibyo bintu nibyo tugomba kurenga tugomba kubirenga ntiduhite twumva yuko niba bavuze iki tugomba gushakisha ama hashtag ashyiramo ngo abahuti bini niba yabatutsi bini ibi reka 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 nta kintu ibyo bintu byatumariye kuba abo turi bo nta kintu byatumariye ariko kubera ibintu twashyizemo nge nge ntanga urugero rw'ukuntu uh, niswe amazina biri ndu umwana banyitaganyira amazuru bakananyitanyira amabuno nkajya mbona nange ubwanje numvaga nyira amazuru rimbabaje ariko nyira amabuno kandi ndu umwana nkumva eh nkumva ko nakuye muri Afrika wenda ari ibintu byiza nkumva ari sawa kugira ibisabo iyo mentalite kugira ngo imvemo kugeza aho nkuze ngiyewe nivugire nti kubera yuko na imfita amazuru manini batugara yanga reka da ntabwo narakuze ntabwo nyiri wa muntu wumvaga yuko ngo ayo mazina hari cyamwigi eh ibyo byitwaga ngo nyira amabuno nakundaga ubunirwa muri gym bayo nshaka kubigabanya mu gukura kwanje namenye yuko it's not ntabwo ari looks ntabwo ari iki ndisobanukiwe nzuwo ndiwe ubu noneho ndashaka kuba healthy ntaho bihuriye nuko umuntu asa ibyo byose tubivemo tubitinyuma ayo mazuru ubwo burebure ubwo buki kubera yuko imana yaturemye ituzi idushaka idusobanukiwe niki ni helegase twasiga kuri yese Okay, sambo tu rera wa yaji ya gato ya alikoreka tu mutegele zendavizi kwa li ugaruke na shaka ga kufuga kuri li jambo yu kuwa walira na shaka ga kufuga kuri li jambo yu kuwa walira na no mhari sese ngu na gato ya murgue bo mjewe mjumba mo no no ho mha nga na za mura wano murgue bo mjumba kumva yu concept yu kuwa walira kujirongo no ho abano bumve ukubabarira uko byagombye kugenda nyabyo koko umva se iri jambo naritekerejeho nsanga kubabarira harimo kubabara harimo nk'ijambo kubabara umva se naho urugero nabaha ni nk'ijambo kuririra urumva kuririra urabona ko ijambo kurira harimo ijambo nyine kurira noneho kuririra umuntu iyo uriri umuntu nuko uba wumvishe akababaroke noneho nawe kakakuriza ukamuririra urumva se noneho ngewe nkumva kubabarira naho harimo iryo jambo ryo kubabara noneho nkumva kubabarira nyabyo ari ukubasha kumva akababaro ku muntu waguhemukiye sirivu re ukababara ugasha ukagerageza kumva nakahe kababaro umuntu waguhemukiye yarafite ukumva ko kababaro ke kakakubabaza ukamubabarira meaning ukababara nkuko na wababara kuko wabashije kumva akababaro yarafite kugira ngo aze kuguhemukira urumva se rero kumubabarira no kubabara nkuko ababara nkuko yababaraga no kumva akababaroke wamara kubyumva wamara kumva ko kababaro yarafite ukamwumva from his perspective no no ukamubabarira ubwo kabumuhaye izo mbabazi urumva se mbega kuri ngewe numva ari kugirira compassion urumva se mbega numva atari forgiveness ari nka compassion as well mukubabarira urumva se ari umubabaro numva se no no rero ikibazo nakwibaza ni niba mwumvisha iryo jambo ko ntisesenguye niba mubyumve mubyumvisha niyo concept ko nchaka ko turiyumva eske wowe wababariye ndahera kuri sampu 
wigeze wumva akababaro uwaguhemukiye yari afite kugira ngo aze kuguhemukira eske wemera ko nawe yari ababaye cyangwa ko nawe hari indwara yari afite urumva se eske urayumva ni yihi yo ndwara yari afite nakahe kababaro yari afite ni ukumva katubwire Animu <laughs> ahubwo nta mwinshi ndari kubizera bari kumaza ngo kuki kari nje nshinzwe ubwica byari organize cyane so we rero yagomba kubikora avuga ko byari nitegeko kana avuga ko yari proud ya byo bari barabibashize hana ambira ati rwose atari ni ndirimbo yabikinde yampaye ngufu cyane tuko yari ndirimbo yavuga ngo nanga bihutu by'ibinebwe nanga ibiki ati ati ra ndirimbo yarafa ati buriya mwebwe baba bari n'iyi ibintu byanyu akanyangira inama ataho guza nyuri n'imbi bintu bituma abantu biyumva urimbo urukundo urimbo ururimbe mbabazi kati koko indirimbo urani ikintu gikomeye ati indirimbo ranyene kajya mu mutima ati bikindi yararirimbye numva ari ngere kubwira ko ndi gihe utuki kintu bwe yes doc we no kwa yarameze um we rero akaba baruvuze nta kwa yarafite we ahubwo akaba baranyuma yarafite ya ahubwo nako uh, nako kumva maze no kumubwira ko nzamubabarira nabibwiye umugore ni wa ugiye kubimubwira umugore we <laughs> abimubwira ati ati nyenze ntuziza ati byo ngiye ni politique ikintu cyamukonvence ko yaravuga izo mbabazi Jean Paul umututsi inkotanye bashe kumbabarira ari muri America arahavuya aja ngo no kumbabarira ati izo mbabazi ati no no ingo yambira ati jampora ati kintu cyatunye nemera ko izo mbabazi zawe atari ari authentic kabisa atari ibyo ati nuko wavuze ko ari imana yagutegetse kubabara iyo utavuga ngo imana yagutegetse kumbabara ati ntabwo nari kubyemera ati umugore wange yarambiye kandi ngo nutemera imbabazi za jampora kuko ni imana yamubwiye ko bara nange sinza kumera kungarukira kuko urumva imbabazi zaragiye zihunga zunga we no mugore we imbabazi z'Imana ziragenda ziratukunga twese iyo nza kuza kuvuga ngo ni gyewe nkasa kuvuga ko ari byanje yo ari kubambyisha ariko navuze ukuri kuko nange ubwanje mani mbwira ko babara narabyanze naranze kugeza integeka naranze pe irantegeka rero ko ishyira itegeko umva ko ari itegeko ibishyira mu ndabikora so kubabarira rero Haina kana mwavuze ari bino mwavuze mimi ari binavuze cyuko nabantu babita se mbabwira urabona imbaraga zo kubabarira nkubu nkubu nabonya ama message ubu turi kuvugana hari nibindi ngo kushampu guratinyutse uje kuganira nabantu babanze u Rwanda none nka basubiza oya nagiye kuganira nabana b'u Rwanda niko nababwiye kuno bari nabakuru bana umwanzi w'u Rwanda nkoya ni umwana w'u Rwanda aso nufite ngo mpamagara byakomeye ngo ya imbaraga zo kubabara cyo mbivuze kubera iki n'ubu turi hano ndi mu ntambara bari mu barantuka ngo ntago nagomba kuvugana nabo kandi imana yambwiye kuvugana giye sinshobora kuza mu kiganga nkasenze mbibabwira ari bo ari imana numvira inde mwoka byarambo ubwo hano nana bivuga si banga nana nabantu none ho nabantu proche Ubone ntambara bora yavuga yaruwize bango shampoo na uzuze none none na muri rinje murankure iki murakore iki ubwo se mwumbure muri bande mwebuke kwaza kabona abantu uwize n'umwatsi w'urwanda gute uwize n'umwana w'urwanda aho yandi bose ko mbonye indirimbo abo mwita abanzi b'urwanda n'abana b'urwanda ufete niyo wa umwanzi niwo bagwa kwitumwa niwo wabukora ibibi uwo mwana intera hamwe nabana b'u Rwanda intera hamwe nabana b'u Rwanda wabishaka utabishaka 
ariko ruwi ndagira ngo gusaba imbabazi kuko ufite ikiganiro nk'iki nano ngiye kujyamo nakwandikiraga nkubwira wambabe rukande kuraho ukabyarawe ariko nkugira ngo nabo ngabo wambuje kabisa nda kure kumeka turuhe uturangirize ku ndirimbo wari ufite hanyuma dutukureke wigendere sinzi niba hari indi ndirimbo wari ufite hanyuma ukayikora hanyuma tukakure kukigendera hanyuma ndakurutira show na mimi rwose Eh okay ndi mwana ita fite se Eh hagataho hagataho ikindi kintu gisekeje para ko yibyo uvuze ikindi kintu gisekeje urumva abanyarwanda bakunda utuntu twa bacakubije urumva ku ruhande rwawe baba bakubije ibyo ngibyo we ugiye kuganira na Louise Sacrilege ku ruhande rwanje haba hari nk'abantu ngayo <laughs> ukibaza se none se muzajya muhora muganira nabo mwumvikana gusa muzajya muhora muganira na bene wanyu gusa muzajya muhora muganira nabo muhuje ibitekerezo gusa ibyo bintu ntago byubaka kana ntacyo bizatugeza aho kuko biba bisa nkaho umuntu ari muri eco chamber iyo abantu bumvikana gusa cyangwa se agira ibintu no anyway sanko tu ngaho dusezere rwose na urakoze cyane urakoze cyane wakoze kuza kutubwira uko bibona kandi rwose imana ikomeze ikurinde kandi ikomeze ikuyobore igukoresha ibintu bizima bizajya bituma nabandi biyubaka nuko you know no ko nyine tubwire niba hari ijambo rya nyuma ufite hanyuma udusezere rwose turabyoba ijambo rya nyuma ntari rutiringire ndabakunda muri abana burwanda period rakose mba barengo bakugenda thank you Thank you so much. Turi kumwe turi kumwe tuzasubira. I love you. They love you, love you, love you. Yo yo yo. <laughs> Eyo mimi, Eva, the love is between you and I dusigara nyuma nta nk'icumi. Um wabyumvishe gute iyi concept yo kubabarira ko harimo ijambo kubabara noneho bigusaba kumva kababaro kubabarira you know wamu ukabyumva from their perspective ukumva ni cyamubabazaga kugira ngo aze kukubabaza noneho rero wajya kumubabarira ukamubabarira mbega wamwumvishe wamwumvishe urabyumva gute wowe ah luise hari ibintu bimaze iminsi tubona kunkoranya kunkora kuri internet batwereka uri ya mugabo wa smith yakubise ah chris ukabireba ukavuga kuti quand même yari yakoze joke yo y'umuntu kurwara ibiki est-ce que kumukubita byari ibyo no do i see where it came from 100% and no no mu buzima busanzwe rero nuko kuntu twagombye tureba no no nkareba nkareba umujinya cyangwa guhembera iyo umuntu atekereje akumva ngo kuntu ngo kuva mu bihe by'ibwami ngo ari abantu abanaba ngo babaga baravukanye imbuto nka hatari umuntu nkanje nawe ngo hanyuma ngo bakabaheka ngo hanyuma ngo bakagira gute ukagenda ubyumva ukuntu umubiri giye ari kuza akareba akavuga ati nuko ukuntu naca amabantu bice noneho abari bari hasi kandi ngo ari bo twavuga ngo nibo bari rubandanya mwinshi bakavuga baka hagera ho bize nabo bakavuga bati natwe it's about time ibyo bikaba 59 ngo bakaba batesheje bamwe baragiye babaye impunzi nabo bagomba kugaruka mu gihugu cyabo kuko aho bagiye kubera impunzi ntaga ari nk'ahano muri Canada uko dufashwe nubwo natwe bwacu twumva yuko hari rasisme niki ariko twakomera ngo ko dufashe neza bo ni bana bemerera kuba abanyagihugu bahuhanda so ibyo bintu byose ngiye ngiye ndabyumva nubwo kubabarira ubivuze nkabyumva uyu munsi icyo kintu cy'ukuntu wabi wa nabonye ikintu wari wabyanditse 
kubaba ra noneho kubabarira mu kubyumva nicyo kintu njya ngira ni abantu barimo baravuga ba politisiye bakavuga wa muntu uje usinya avuga nti nyamara ngiye ndamwumva bakavuga bari abagabo bitwa ba Anastase Gasana nkavuga nti nyamara bakavuga kuri wa muntu wabaye president genocide kirangira bizi mungu nkavuga nti Rea bukuntu yari ariho afite afite mu vice president uwo mwanya hi wongeye kubaho nyamara ngiye bizi mungu ndamwumva icyo kintu naragishoboye cyo kugira ngo nivane ibitekerezo ngiye muri uwo mwanya w'umuntu ariko bikagera ahantu nange mba unapologetically myself ku buryo mvuga nti okay ndabyemera yuko wenda uko ibyo bintu byo kwitwa ngo nari naravutse nitwa umututsi kuko ngiyewe biologically niki ntago bira bintu cy'ambisobanukirwa sinabyemera nemera yuko yo wavutse mu muryango w'umuntu shaka kuba naravutse mu muryango wa kagabo nta DNA yari hari ntago mvuze ko my mom was a cheater i don't think she would ever even think about it ariko kuno dufata yo DNA tukayifata nka hitamba nshobora kuba abe we wakagabo kabasoma ingera nibyo ariko sinshake gufata icyo kintu cyuko ngo barabatutsi ngo ngaba ari cyo kintu cyonyine nambara kuko really ntabyo nzi ntabyo numva niyo mpamvu ikintu cyo mu Rwanda ngiyewe kingora kucyumva impamvu ariyo myenda dushaka kwambara mbere y'ibindi byose kuki uwo mwenda w'ubwoko ari wo dushaka kwikwiza kubera iki twakwikuye mu kirya kintu ko nta nicyo twacyatumariye ariko tukagikoresha kugira ngo twumve twumve impamvu revolution muri 5 ni 9 yagombaga twumve impamvu muri 90 wavuga kuti ndabone impamvu izo nkotanye zagombaga gutera ariko se byari bikuye kwinera hamwe zibaho cyane cyane byaba bimeze nk'iyo turi kuvuga ngo black lives matter bakavuga ngo white lives matter too turabizi ko all lives matter ariko muri aka kanya turi kuvuga abashyizwe hasi muri kiragiye intera hamwe zavukaga byari bikwiye bo batari barashyizwe hasi abo bantu benshi bari bari mu ntera hamwe so inkotanye zitera est-ce que byari bikwiye obviously abo bantu bashakaga gutahanga kandi baravuga ngo igihugu kiruzuye ukavuga kuti okay ndumva nubwo mbumve impamvu bateye ntabwo numva impamvu bisha abaturage ibyumba sinzigera byumva ukagenda wumva ibintu bimwe ukavuga kuti ntabwo ngiye gufata aba bantu ngo batunge intoki nka wa mugabo rero watumiye avuga ati ntabwo ikibazo ari ugutunga intoki ahubwo ikibazo ni gute twababara mu myanya ya bari abantu garuke kuri za nyigisho za niyo mugabo ko twese twagushije ishyano arabishe arabishe arabiciwe tubabarire n'umuntu rebe ukuntu nshobora kwandika data abantu bakavuga bati yakina ngo umupira ari umugabo mwiza ugeze gute Muri ibaza ko hari abana hano hanze bashobora kwandika se badashobora kwandika se kuko yari umwicanyi how about uwo mwana kuki kuki nta kwishyura muri urwo rukweto rwe ngo mvuge ngo ngenda nemye kubera yuko uwo muntu yishwe ese we ese we yari intungane ntabwo yari intungane icyo kintu cyo kwifata tukigira mu myanya yabandi bantu nicyo kintu cy'ambere kizatugeza kubumwe nubwiyunge atari bwa bundi bwo kumva ngo namoko agomba kwiyunga reka da ni bya bindi tugomba kwiyunga natwe bwacu tukiyunga ni imana noneho tukiyunga nabagenzi bacu tutagiye kubirebera ngo kubera ko Luisa Sokoje Tank nange tukaba ngo tumeze nka Samusuri ngo niyo mpamvu tugomba kumenyana ngo kubera ko twese tuba muri Canada ngo kubera ko ngo dukunda kubyina reka 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 ntago ari kugira ngo tube duhuje ibintu kugira ngo tube bamwe ahubwo no umuntu tutagira icyo duhuje nawe mwumve nibibe impamvu yo kumwataka ngo nje kwataka ibubu yambaye nange nti yatake tuno tuno nambara tugera hano twumve yuko ibyo byose nibishira nta biduhuza ngo kugira ngo bidutare mhm 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 antuka iyi ni subject ndende cyane dushobora kuzavuga nyine igihe kirekire antuka wakoze cyane kuza a uh, kuvuga icyo bitekerezaho uh, nakunze ko sambutu yabuze ko ari imana yamubwiye gahunda yo kujya kubabarira ari ibintu byamuvuye ku mutima uh, nibaza ko nabandi bose ari ibintu bigomba kuva ku mutima w'umuntu na muntu ugomba kugutegeka kubabarira uh, kujya kubabarira abandi urumva se na muntu ugomba kubigutegeka uko icyo gihe ntago biba ari genuine um hanyuma kandi nyine nkuko twabivuze byo kubabarira kugerageza kumva akababaro undi muntu yarafite kugira ngo noneho binakorohereze kumubabarira kuko amfete ngiyewe mbona ari cyo kintu cyamfashije cyane urumva se kumva akababaro undi muntu yarafite kugira ngo ubashe kumubabarira donc urabona abanyarwanda since conflict ihera muri 99 kumva 
akababaro inkotanyi zari zifite mu Uganda kugira ngo zishoze intambara irwanda ako kababaro kabyumva noho ukavuga kuti okay ndababariye kubera ko hariho ako kababaro ariko nkuko wabivuze ukavuga kuti ibi ibyaha byo bigomba kujya mu gutabera niba hari crime zabayeho zigomba kujya mu gutabera hanyuma rero kubyerekeye ibyabaye muri 1994 njewe nyine ejo bundi nyine yakoze poste nyine isaza abantu benshi ariko nkuko naye narabivuze ngiye ndu mutanga wa bya donc nokuvuga ngo kuvuga tu simplema ibyo waciyemo donc byo kuvuga ngo ibuka ibyo wibuka nange nibuke ibyo nibuka urumva se none l'essentiel nuko buri muntu wese avuga ukuri ukuri kwe urumva se hanyuma ayo masoriyo se nyine akazabaho agasigara ari amateka ubundi nge nkakurasha nabantu kwandika amateka yabo kuko ejo bundi abantu barokotse ibi bintu bazaba batakinariho wowe nange tuzaba tutakiriho ariko amateka azaba kenewe byaba byiza rero abantu baritse amateka yabo ikindi kandi mbona nerutse kubwira abandi bantu bari bari barimo bakomemorating abacika cumo nuko byaba ari win win byaba ari double win urumva se abantu baramutse babashije kwandika amateka yabo urumva no, uh, not only babashije kwandika amateka yabo kwandika ubwabo mu publishing stories zabo na byubwa byo nitera ariko none no babashije no gusiga iye education for generations to come and then how about baramutse none no banagurishije ibyo bitabo byabo cyangwa se ibyo bitabo byabo bikazavamo na movies bakagurisha bakagira amafaranga urumva ko icyo gihe bakuyemo n'amafaranga bazasigira na next generation eritaje eritaje itari umubabaro gusa urumva se eritaje itari umubabaro gusa kuberako amarira ya amarira y'abantu yabyaye n'amafaranga ni nacyo kibazo cyo kwagirizaho umbega ibitugwa ngo twubake twibaka wibuke ku buryo uzana komera ariko se yavuga ni amarira yacu aramutsa byaya amafaranga byabagwa nabi duhindure formule umubabaro uve mu ibyishimo urumva se umubabaro ushobora kuvamo iyo content ukavamo ibyo byishimo ukavamo nayo amafaranga ukavamo niyo heritage none no next generation nkizagire heritage ya marira gusa urumva se ni cyo rero numva narangirizaho sinzi wowe mimi uko bibona Uh, no otherwise ngira abantu bose ko iyi platform ari open to everyone ta muntu mpeza um kandi nako nshobora kutaganira n'umuntu ngo nuko tudahuje cyangwa se twigeze gushwana aho this and this and this and that uh, rero iyo tumi abantu uh, bakavuga ngo ntibari buze mu kubera ko kana 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 kaba hari na kaskabo urumva se na kaskabo ngewe ntago nzarekeraho tumira abantu bose no gushaka kuganira n'abantu bose uzaje wumva atari comfortable kuza nta kaza ariko ubona tumiya kemera kaza azaje za tuganire kubera ko everybody is welcome urumva se rero nge nta muntu mpeje ariko abantu badesida kwiheza na kaska ya baravuze ngo be the change you want in the world niba turi gushakisha yuko turi abactiviste turi gushakisha yuko tuganira tukavuga nta muntu numwe twagombye guheza cyane cyane yuko isi yose ibaye abantu batekereza nkawe Louise ntabwo ibintu wandika byaba bikinsetsa kuko nange byaba bindimo so birashimishije yuko mwebwe ba melody mubaho mudusetsa kandi mutwigisha hakabaho nabandi baza bakandika ibintu ukavuga kuti hari gye mbyuka nkandika ibintu ndanza bisoma nyuma y'imisi ibiri nkavuga ariko buriya isi yamo na paragraph kubera iki ni ibyo nyine biraza ngo ukavuga kuti ah you know it's okay ko nange mbona bisohoye gutyo uko bimeze umuntu yabibona akabona akavuga ati biba byavuye ku mutima ariko nturi umwanditsi too simple you know so nta isi ya biri boring ibayemo bamwebwe gusa cyangwa ibayemo banje we gusa mureke icyo kintu tujye tucyubahanira tugikundaniremo twumve yuko the change dushaka izatangirana natwe niba hari umuntu muri akanya mu Rwanda wumva ko atakwicarana nange kubera amahitamo yange ikintu cyonyene namufungurira 
no kumwereka yuko ngiyewe ndi red and open yo kuganira n'umuntu wo ari we wese yewe niyo yabantuka kubera yuko ni tugomba kwemera ku um, kuba umuntu ikintu ndwanira nuko numuntu uvuga ibyo ntashaka kumva nawe abona platform yo kuvugira murakoze Absolutely. All right, Mimi, thank you so much. I appreciate you. Thank appreciate you. your time. Eva, na kabisa tukumwe kule kwa heri ya muri February tuvuga ngo tuzaje dukora pari uri uri kwezi. Let's see niba tuzaje za muri next February. You know, so thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Tawe akazikeza nuko tuzasubira nubuta. Tawa sawa. All right. All right, my people, that's it. That's it. That's it. Thank you, everyone, for being here. Mga akose chane, mga akose chane. Nibari chivazo mufite, nda chumva, nda chumva. Nibari comment mufite na isu bizar, dugo sena chivazo. Nuko ni kubona awa butuka ni waba jifiti chiva zo. Aha, 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 aha. You know, lero tuki yu wake kugurijo numunu. Adashobara kufuika naranje. Mkwa pufe kuguko meretzi. Mbase, tuki yu wake kugurijo tujira amahoro numune zero. Muri tuke yuge kugurijo tushobara no kubijira. Muri ibi bihe, ibi ibi bikome chana. Wabimenchi bachi ya mubi ibi bikome. Kuibu keko ni wamwe meri mana ni wamwe meri juru ni wamu vizi kuima ni ho kadi kodi juru diri ho imana na mahoro urumva se imana na mahoro ni wutari mu mahoro na aguri kumwe ni iman kujira ngo uwe mu maho kujira ngo aguri kumwe ni iman na ugomba kuba uri mu mahoro jamu mahoro rero ni wugo uzawa aguri kumwe ni iman. Nko mga wivonye na heri kumga ndisi wumuli kongo, amani, ijambo, amani, bisobanura, amahoro, muchi. Sikuwa hile, mura wana neza kwa hili, the same, the same, 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 inyuguti na imana. Bifunga ngo, imana equals, amani equals, amahoro. Nusha wa kuburi kumge ni imana, ni wutari mu mahoro. Nusha wa wana kuburi kumge na wana, wabuze, ni wutari mu mahoro, numuneze. Unless, of course, Uumva wara jie mumuriro, uumva wari kumena chitani, ugicho jie njine, baba ho njine wari muri murugu ango, no muri drama zose, aba anuba hora. Hariko rero, si ibjongi ibjo uifuris. Uumva se, si ni ibjongi ibjo wa uifuris. Aba anuwa huze, barashaka kuba honeza, ukawa ho uishimye, ukaba huri mu mahoro ukaba ho mu bukire barashaka kubaho nta kintu ubuze rero baho gutyo nibwo uzaba ubashimishije nibwo nawe ubwawe uzaba ubayeho neza urumva se nuko rero my people mwakoze cyane turi kumwe ubundi kera nzababwira uko ntekereza uko kera tuzajya dukora umuhango wo kwibuka uko nyine byajemo politike chane, aliko nijeze kutechele za ni hashobara kuwa ho kuhivuka kuhivuka abantu wali mbijishi mkukwa nanone kuhivuka abantu wichu kwa gusa ni mkwa kuwa ho za mburi yo circle yumu wabar ushobara nanone kuhivuka abantu wabaye ho mbijishi mo ushobara kuhivuka ibiji za bijabaye ho mbateka yuru wanda abantu bashobora gukora za festival urumva se za festival zimurika niba abantu badesize kuguma mu byamo kwa yabo bagakora festival bakerekana ibyiza by'abatutsi ibyiza by'abahutu ibyiza by'abatwa bakerekana ibyiza by'urwanda abanyarwanda nyine bakagira ko igiye cyo kwibuka cyabari nk'igiye cyo kumurika ibyiza byose byabo bantu twabuze aho kugira ngo abantu bibuke bari mu marira dukeneye ko abantu bakira kandi ukuntu twibuka nabo nzi niba bijyana kugukira kwa abantu narubwo nzi niba abapolitician nabayobozi bifuza ko abantu bakira kuko usanga hari igihe biba byoroshye kuyobora abantu iyo ari abantu barwaye bari week hanyuma rero ukabakoresha icyo wishakiye ikintu narangirizaho ngarutse kubyo sambo tuyaguze 
ku byerekya kababaro niba yarumvisha kababaro ku muntu wahimuhemukiye ikintu numvishemo gikomeye cyane nukumva ko umuntu wamuhemukiye n'umuntu wagiye kwica iwabo umuntu wabere umwicanyi n'umuntu wakurikije amabwiriza my people icyo kintu cyo gukurikiza amabwiriza mu kinyarwanda mu banyarwanda ni ikintu gikomeye cyane kandi ni ikintu abantu bagomba kwirinda kandi icyo kintu n'uyu munsi kugeza n'uyu munsi icyo kintu kiracyariho abantu bakurikiza amabwiriza avuye ubukuru abategeka gukora ikibi kandi bakayubahiriza ubwo mwumvishe neza ko umuntu wahimukiye kwa Sambutu yari arimo akurikiza amabwiriza yabitegetswe kandi bamushyiraho icyo kintu za cyo kuvuga ngo nuta bikurikiza nawe urapfa rero twikebuke twibuke twikebuka twibuke twiyubaka twumve ko icyo kintu cyo gukurikiza amabwiriza cyamaza abantu benshi noneho twibaze kuri uyu munsi naho haracyari w'icyo kintu abantu baracyakurikiza amabwiriza bataza havuye kandi amabwiriza ababwira gukora ibintu bibi rero ya never again yacu kugira ngo ibe ruyo nuko no muri mentality y'abanyarwanda haza micyo kintu cyuko nibo bonya amabwiriza yo gukora ikibi ugomba kuyanga nuko na kindi rero nagukaga my people murakoze cyane mwakoze cyane abaje kugira ngo tuganire abataje nabwo ni uburenganzira bwanyu ariko ngewe nababwira ko ino platform iri open iri open ku bantu bose na numwe meza ubwo abazajya bebera bakaza tukaganira nyine muri so welcome umuntu ushaka kugira icyo avuga ajya mbwira muhe muhe umwanya muri show izakurikiraho niba wumva ushaka kuza kuri show hano kugira icyo uvuga uzanye ndikire umbwire hanyuma rero rwose nzakuzanamo ugira icyo uvuga dore mushobora kunyandikira mu bicishije kuri watch.com no koma ipipo murakoze murakoze cyane mugire umugoro bamwiza turi kumwe turi kumwe turi kumwe ndabakunda sante wa muko ciao 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 my people turi kumwe turi kumwe turi kumwe all right yeah man we're done bye Thank <laughs> you.